All right, I think we're about ready to go. Time to play some Sonic Adventure. I'm playing the GameCube version because Sonic, wait here for why me. not? <laughs> I don't have the Dreamcast version. I know I could find the Dreamcast version. I don't need to swap that thing over. Yeah, I don't have the Dreamcast version. I do have the Steam version, but it's basically just this game ported over to Steam. Besides, I mean, I'm pretty sure my computer can handle Steam running everything else, including this. I don't know. I uh, Either way, it should be fine. I don't know. I just felt like booting up Dolphin. No particular reason. But yes, we're going to go for every emblem. That includes the Chow Garden. Come on, load. Save was complete. There we go. We will have to go through all six characters plus the final story, and then we'll get all the emblems later. We'll probably work on the Chow along the way, maybe. I don't know. Let's be honest, the Chow will probably be saved for last. Let's get started with Sonic Story. Gotta love the Dreamcast look, right? <laughs> Honestly, like, I, I love Sonic Adventure 1 and 2. These are... These are nostalgic for me. But S Sonic Adventure 2 is... The Sonic game for me. I do think I like the explorable world of SA1 a lot, but like the stages of Sonic Adventure 2 are so good. Hope everything's running fine. Everything seems fine to me. Oh, what is that audio? Is that slow down? Yeah, that doesn't sound good. Will it fix itself after a little bit? Yeah, it sounds like it fixed itself. Yeah, okay. Okay, good. That was just a temporary thing. Now to fight this liquid creature. Chaos here, and the audio's weird again. Why is the audio weird again? Wait, is this slow down? Oh no. Is, okay. If the game's gonna be like this, this is not the right thing to do. Um. May give it a bit, see if it fixes itself. If it doesn't, maybe we'll try the Steam version and see if that goes any better. But yeah, there's definite slowdown. Uh, okay, it's working fine now. Nope, then stopped. Huh. This is, this is annoying. Can my computer not handle running Dolphin as well? Uh, as well as everything else running at the same time? We know it can run Elden Ring, but it's not really running Elden Ring. It's just a screen capture at that point. 
This is actually trying to run Sonic Adventure. Come on, you big drip. Where are you going? I mean, if the slowdown was only temporary, maybe we might be fine, but... You know nothing, fool! It's Chaos, the god of destruction! <laughs> so I'm just kind of letting it run just to see if it goes well. Huh? What? Tails? I mean, everything sounds fine to me. Oh no, Tails, you fool! I thought you were good at flying! Well, now we need to go- we need to go this way to chase after Tails. What do you do? Emerald Co- welcome to Emerald Coast. We'll take it out in a second. Not that I never really talk to these people, but what do they say? Then crash over the beach, I hope the pirate's okay. Mr. Sonic, please, go- go see if you can save him! Hi, I'm Mr. Know-It-All. Here's a clue. Grab the spinny rings. It's important. As long as you got the rings, you'll be okay, even if you hit any hazards. Now you know. Oh, and don't worry if the view suddenly changes. It does that sometimes. Just keep moving in the direction you want. It may take a little bit of time to get used to it, so keep trying. I have never actually talked to these people. They are temporary. Ah, uh, there's a little bit of slowdown right there. Ah, hmm. Oh, just my luck. A monster appears and then a plane falls. I came here to relax. This is unbelievable. Is that it? Okay. I could just ignore Tails. What does everyone actually have to say? Hotel manager, call me if you need anything. By the way, I heard a loud noise. It sounded like it came from the beach. You should take a look. Oh, now I need to know how much I can actually explore. I usually just go straight to Emerald Coast. I can't do this. Hmm. The audio's changing again. I can't go in there. For now, the casino's open, only open at night. And I can't leave, okay. Can I go? I can go in the chow garden. Oh, there's someone in the water. What? What happened? I was swimming, and I missed it. Alright. Let's actually go to Emerald Coast. This is not going well, isn't it? I... I don't know if this is working. Uh, I, I could try booting up the Steam version. I don't think that would run as well. Or just be about the same. Can my... Can my computer not handle running... Oh, well, here's the problem. I think it's like... Because my computer's trying to run the PNG... Uh, program, the stream avatars program, streaming it all together, and running even a GameCube game, a GameCube emulator. Like, running all that together? I guess it can't handle it. 
I mean, we know we can handle, like, Super Nintendo. Can he even run 64? I mean, it's been a while since I streamed a 64 game. I don't know. Uh, let's finish Emerald Coast. At the very least. I was more excited to play this! But, I don't know if this is gonna work. Now I almost want to just test other GameCube games and see if we have the same problem. Ooh. I don't want to play like this. Let's keep it going. I mean, most of the time it kind of is okay. I'm not... Most of the time it's okay. But then when the slow when the slowdown happens, it I never have these problems when I play Sonic Adventure. Oh my god. And it seems to be in certain spots. Luckily, on the first round through of each stage, we're not worried about... We're not worried about, you know, score or anything. We're just trying to get to the end. Now, one trick... You know what? I'm going to play through the stage normally, but there is a shortcut we could do right here. We'll have to play through the stage again anyway. Later. So, I don't have a problem going through the stage normally. Jump on panel number one. It will take you to panel two and three. Jump as soon as you land on the panel or else you'll fall. I mean, it seems to be running fine now. Well, we caught up to Tails. Not the best time, but I wasn't going for time. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, this game's emblem system. Uh, this game doesn't have a, a ranking system, so a lot of times it's just, oh, complete the mission. Okay. As long as you beat it, it doesn't matter. Hey, Sonic. Long time no see, huh? I'm just glad you're okay. What happened anyway? You're too good of a pilot to just crash like that. That was a test run using a new prototype to both system. It's got a few bugs to iron out. Why not just use my plane, the tornado? I forget the tornado is technically Sonic's. Even though you really only see tails fly it. I mean, nothing could go wrong with that, right? It's 
Now, one thing about Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, the, the music, the, the music audio quality is, like, completely, like, unbalanced. Yeah, just go through the hotel lobby and go right through the door to Station Square. I'm sorry, but I overheard the conversation. I didn't mean to, though. It's not like you were just right here and you're very loud. You know, you also got the music playing over you as well. Kind of surprised you heard that. I'm glad to hear the little fox... I'm glad to hear the little fox piloting the plane was safe. But again, I never talk to these people. I feel great. There's nothing like swimming in pools in the ocean in the summer. This is the first time I'm really talking to these characters, so I might as well show it off. We can't go this way. Hotel manager, call me if you need... By the way, if you want to visit the Chow Garden, take the left elevator. Chow are so cute. They are indeed. Hold on, before we do that, can we set up... Oh, come on, really? What do you have to say? Do you like the view from the station? I love the sea. The sea's always there for me. Good for you, man. La la la, we're in love. There's a special for couples at Twinkle Park. If you bring a date, you can get it for free. Oh, I can't talk to the girl? Okay. Can you go in? I forget, was there something in here? Uh, I don't think there was. Yeah, there's. I don't think there's anything this way. It's been a few years since I played Sonic Adventure. Have you heard? Somewhere out there is a man called Dr. Robotnik. First he captures helpless animals. Then he throws them into machines. All oh, the poor animals. Oh, I can't go this way yet? Dang it. All right, let's just go into the train station. The train headed for the Mystic Ruins will be departing. I'm Mr. Noel. I'm here. Here's a tip. When you jump, it makes a big difference. How long you hold down the button. Hold it longer and you can jump longer and higher. Did you know that? Yes. Finally, Station Square. I'm going to the beach, the casino in Twickle Park. I gotta get past the slowdown. This is the center of Station Square. If you want to go to the Mystic Ruins, take the train. If you're going to do research, the trip's free, of course. Only a real adventurer takes a trip to such a remote place. Uh, I'm not there for research, so can I go in for free? I'm a, I am a hedgehog. Low pay, hard work. What am I doing? Oh, customer! Well, I'm sorry. Station Square Central. This train is heading to Mystic Ru Ruins. This guy's overworked. Not getting paid enough for it. Okay, hold on. Can we turn the camera? There is an emblem over there. Some emblems are on the overworld. Oh. What do you have to say? Look around. The train's packed with exhausted people. But look at me. I'm full of energy. Yeah, so many exhausted people. All one of them. All one of them. Let's see if I can pull this off. You might... I don't know if you could pull this off as Sonic. Yes, camera. You're helping me. Maybe do a spin dash jump, but... It's kind of hard to... If I... Or we could just do that. Second emblem. You could get the emblem overworld once with almost any character. I say almost. Some characters I'm meant for. I think you're supposed to get that as either Tails or Knuckles, but a proper spin dash jump will get it as Sonic. Is this slow down? Oh, no. Okay, only in some spots. When I woke up, the mountain was there already. 
I didn't think it sprung out of the ground. So it must have fallen from the sky. I know it sounds crazy. Uh, okay. I'm not sure if we want to continue this. We heard that there were ruins of an ancient civilization here. We came to check it out. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm trying to think back to when I tested out GameCube very quickly, when I did my test stream. Um, I didn't have stream avatars. I didn't have the PSG. I just used the webcam. A house on the top of the hill. A fox named Tails lives there. Tails call it, calls it his workshop. Maybe that's where Tails is now. I'll go talk to him later. Uh, I can't do anything about that. Yeah, maybe I didn't have any issues with that test stream because it wasn't running so many things. I just would have thought my computer could handle everything plus GameCube. Anything past GameCube. Push that, and that thing gets launched. float down over here. No. Come on. Come on, Sonic. You can pick it up. Alright. We got an egg. Okay, yeah, it's over here that we need to go. Jeez, the slowdown. I mean, slow down for Sonic is not, you know, not new. It's not usual for me to experience slow down with this game. So if we take this path over here, and we take this minecart, get in, get in the minecart, Sonic. There we go. Yeah, yeah, create a uh, child garden save file. Yeah, I know. We're in the Mystic Ruins child garden. And if we take... Why is the camera not working? Oh, I can't. Okay. Well, for now, we're just leaving that here. There were three gardens for the child garden. Uh, the first time you open up the child garden and each one can, uh, already starts with two eggs the but that silver one will be uh, that silver one can only be obtained uh well or the easiest way to attain it is through where i picked it up and you gotta plop it in one at least one of the child gardens i'm gonna leave it alone what do you say i found a child garden in the mystic ruins it's on the other side of this cave but don't tell anyone else Okay. You get you can tell that the that the slowdown's only in spots. Hmm. <laughs> if it isn't Sonic. Look, it's a giant talking egg. Silence. Time to fight Eggman, it is. Doesn't take long to fight him. Eh, but that's normal for Eggman. Well, what's funny is, uh, 
So in the U.S., in the, in the Genesis games, he was known as Robotnik, at least in America. In Japan, he was always known as Eggman. Uh, and you can even see it on, in like Sonic 2, during, what was it, Sky Fortress, you can see the Eggman logo. So in Japan, he was always known as Eggman. So I think that whole line right there at least might just be a American localization. Where he calls himself Robotnik, but Sonic then calls him Eggman as like a nickname or insult. And not just him, that's actually his name and what he calls himself. So I think, and, and from now on in the games, he's just called Eggman. They don't really try to call him Robotnik. So I, I think this was just a way to explain what his name actually is and kind of transition to using that permanently. It's my explanation. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. It's a case where maybe a localization might have a localization change was probably the right idea. To fix an error, I guess? To fix a different localization? Makes me wonder what the line was anyway. I think at some point, though, Japan kind of adopted the his true name being Robotnik, though. So it kind of still ends up working out. Well, that wasn't so hard. I love how Eggman's just, like, using the force to hold it up. He's not actually holding it. Where'd he come from? Everything just kind of spawns it out of nowhere. Well, start fighting. Do something, Sonic. Okay, it's too late now. Not like you couldn't have done anything. Now he has a giant anchor arm. But only one, though. Why? Oh, right. I forget, this is where the Robotnik land plan just kind of started. This is like the first time he actually acknowledged he wants to build Robotnik land. I forgot about that. Or Eggman land, whatever. Well, we gotta go get all the seven, get all the Chaos Emeralds. I mean, it's kind of normal for us. There's nothing over here, is it? Yeah. It's kind of nice to be able to explore, but like, there's not much to actually do, sadly. At least not in this mode. Oh, I thought we were supposed to go in here. Oh, duh. Looks like a key. The design must mean something. Hmm. Wait, do you say something different? I don't remember you being here. That shiny mark on your stone. It looks like the mark on the plate. I found it in the cave. Is it possible? Could it be? Does any actually, does anyone else say anything? Say anything new, I should say? This is our base camp. Another party has gone into the jungle. Until we hear from them, we can't run the trolley. Actually, now I'm curious. What do you say? Really need to explore the mountain, but I don't even know where to start. Uh, the glowy light just points you in the direction you need to go. Tails workshop should be around here somewhere. 
We're the exploration party searching for the ruins. Our motto is go everywhere, search everywhere, discover everything. Actually, do you say anything? Hey, that's the stone I found! You, you're not gonna take it away, are you? I didn't even know you found it in the first place. Well, I'm stealing it, because I know where it goes. And your team is not, like, talking to each other clearly and not giving each other information. On to Windy Valley. There we go. All for an electric shield. I am not liking the slowdown. Oh, is the parrot trying to catch up to me? It is. There we go. The animals are for the chow. We'll probably be messing around with the chow garden here in a little while. Ugh. Um... Swept up by a tornado. So, I've been... Th I was thinking of... So, the reason why I wanted to do SA1 and SA2 was because the new uh, Sonic 3 movie is coming out next month, and I wanted to play them. We may be playing them back-to-back. But now I'm questioning that. Yeah, now I'm questioning my decisions. Molly, what? Uh, Molly, stop. Come on. Molly. Stop. I know you want attention. I know you're needy, but you're fine. You're fine. Let's go up. Where's your bone? Where's your bone? Come on. Over here. Come on. I am questioning now whether or not to continue. I did not think the computer would have this much of an issue running GameCube. I could... I don't know. Oh yeah, uh, we'll probably end up, assuming everything works out fine, we'll probably end up uh, playing both Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 back-to-back. -back. And if not back-to-back, -back, I may play something like Link's Awakening in between, like a shorter game. But the plan is to focus on Sonic Adventure 1 and 2. Come on. Oh. There we go. Come on, hit the spring. There we go. Oh yeah, so I'm playing the GameCube version. Technic like, retro achievements is a thing, but sadly... As of right now, GameCube, Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 are not, uh, do not have achievements yet. Sonic Heroes does, though, but we're not going to jump to Sonic Heroes for a little while. As well as Shadow the Hedgehog now when I'm thinking about it. Or Sonic Riders. Come on, let me grab that. Oh, a single ring. Thanks, game. The one ring is totally worth it, I swear. Yeah, normally I just 
speed through that. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, we got another Chaos Emerald. The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. Will be departing soon. I think... Oh my god. The sl why is it like... Why does it have this much of an issue? Okay, hold on. Do you say anything new? What's with the big gusts of wind inside that cave? Hmm, I guess it's called Windy Cave. I guess I'll call it Windy Cave. This is our base camp. Okay, you say this- you say the same thing. Eventually the people will disappear. So now I'm just checking to see what they- I, again, I never talked to them. Yeah, I've been explorer for two and a half years. Chaos Emerald? Sorry, never heard of it. Not very likely not very likely you'll find her around here. Even though I literally just got one. Have two more to talk to, but we need to head back to Station Square. We have no idea what happened. We're trying to figure out how this mountain could just appear out of nowhere. Yeah, kind of a strange mountain indeed. With the expiration. Yeah, okay. Oh, wait. We're the exploration party searching for the ruins. Of course, we missed the city. Looking for something? You should probably go to the city. You can find just about anything you want there. Yeah, the fact that you heard the little uh, radio saying the train's ready to go to Station Square, that's basically telling you, hey. You're done here for now. Leave. And I guess the other people is basically telling you, yeah, leave. Go. Get out of here. But there's also the little ball of light. Are you overworked still? My work hours get longer, but my salary stays the same. What's the point? Oh, a customer! I'm sorry. Station Square Central! Make sure you don't forget your belongings. This guy's overworked, man. He really needs a different job or ask for a raise, my dude. Hey, it's Sonic. Is it true you saved the entire world? What's happening with Angel Island? I didn't know they referenced Sonic 3 like that. I go to the casino every night. The lights are really pretty at night. Uh. My husband is an adventurer. When he leaves home, you never know when he'll be back. He's probably at the Mystic Ruins looking for old relics. Maybe you met him. Maybe I did. I don't know. What do you have to say? I'm waiting for my dad. I hope he comes back soon. Is he going to stay at the office again? Wait. Are you the... Yeah, you are. Okay, you're walking around. What do you have to say, my dude? I own this building. Well, not sure about this, but... Kids love to go on little treasure hunts. Once found my son in a weird pair, found a weird pair of shoes in the sewer. I told him to put them back, and he ran outside. Wait. Uh, no. Nothing here. Oh, I'm I'm dumb. Okay. I know what he's talking about. Uh, let's go this way. Oh, what do you say? Today's paper says, Mysterious person left a manhole cover open. I hear City Hall's getting a ton of complaints. Sure, it stinks, but it's really dangerous if someone falls in. Hey, I saw the coolest pair of shoes! Supposed to make you feel lighter than air, but they're hidden in a secret spot. It'd be perfect for you, Sonic, if you could find them. I never knew they, like, pointing you in the direction of these shoes. What's up with the girl? She's been standing there all day. It's just staring at the burger shop. The manhole cover is open. We have to listen to everything the people say. 
It is a tough job to work at City Hall. Well, let's go into the sewer. No, nothing here. I can't push that. Luckily, Son can jump high enough to get up here. We got our first upgrade. Now you've got light speed shoes. Press and hold the action button to store up power. Once you have enough power, release the button and you can do the light speed dash. The light speed dash lets you race toward rings at light speed. As long as there's a trail of rings, you can go just about anywhere. Light speed dash is fun to use. However, in this game, it just takes a little while to charge up. Ready, go. Well, it's fun to use. And that leads me in here. Hey, don't use the back door. Why does the back door le lead to the sewer? Hey, look, a golden egg. Oh, I can't leave. Fine. Actually, hold on. If you take a look around. No. Nope. There it is. There's this rock that's just shaped like an egg. Actually, hold on. Little girl, what do you have to say? Oh, it sure, sure fooled me. I, it's just the statue in front of the burger shop. I heard it goes on trips sometimes, though. Take this rock. Swap it for the for the golden egg. And there, we can steal this chow egg. And this guy won't care. He does not care that we're just stealing his egg. Time to put this in a safe spot. Oh, I think in Lightspeed shoes, like, change things around. In terms of, like, characters and dialogue. Here we go. We can set the egg here. And now that we've been to both of these Chow Gardens... You could just use these transporters to just go between different gardens. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Where's the silver one? I usually like to put everything in the main garden. Even though the other two gardens are better looking. It's just the other garden is usually more convenient. There's the silver one. I don't know if we're going to hatch these just yet. I'm just gonna leave the eggs here. Like I said, every time you, you open a new chow garden, there's two of the normal eggs. You get basically two free chow. There we go. I just want the silver one here for now. And by the way, the chow garden is technically a separate save. <laughs> so I can literally delete the save file. And, like, you could complete the game altogether, delete the save file, and your chow still are kept. I'm the hotel manager. Call me if you need anything. By the way, check out the door to the left. If you want to go to the casino, take your time and enjoy yourself. Maybe we will. Hold on, but before we do that, that opens a trail of rings, that opens the door. Ready, go. Going here we get an optional power-up. This is the crystal ring. This reduces the time needed to store power for the light speed dash. Oh, that's so needed. <laughs> that is mandatory. Before we go to the casino, let me go ahead and talk to, to see what the people actually have to say. I told her, it's late, go home. But she won't listen. I just hope she doesn't make her parents worry. 
dad. Oh, she's still waiting for her dad. Do you say anything different now that I've been in the sewer? I own this building. Not sure about this, but... I heard a rumor. Uh, the casino has a new pinball machine. It's called Nights into Dreams. I want to play too. What do you have to say? Everything's changed now that I got the sneak... Got the light speed dash shoes. I'm pretty mature for my age, so I can stay out late. My mom keeps bugging me to study. Actually, does this game... Okay, they don't change dialogue until you move on with the plot. Even just ever so slightly. I guess getting light speed dash shoes moves on with the plot. It is mandatory to get. The day is the day is done and work is over. Let's hit the casino! <laughs> yes! Gamble all your money away. Please don't do that. I set a new record. I got to so close this time. Oh my, I'm truly in love. So, I think her... This is like a little side story that happens throughout the game. I think, if I remember correctly, she's in love with this statue. But she might not know it's a statue. I forget. Or is she trying to get into the... I forget the details on that little quest. Not side quest. Oh, it sure fooled me. It's just the statue in the in front of the burger shop. I hear it goes on trips sometimes, though. We can't go in there. And this is where we fought chaos. Okay. I think we can move on to the casino. I think what she means by it goes on trips is this. I, I'm taking it on a trip. Do you say anything? Nope. There, I'm taking the statue on a trip. I don't think there's anyone else. Oh! What do you two have to say? Twinkle Park's cool, but Casinoopolis sounds fun too. Oh, I just can't decide where to go first. Shower Cube, have you seen them yet? You can see them in the hotel lobby. They're so sweet. I haven't actually seen the chows yet. We just got some eggs, though. Has the sun gone down? I hate the stars. Why do you hate the stars? What's wrong with the stars? I know I'm taking my time with Sonic Adventure, but I, I never actually seen this dialogue, and I bet many people playing Sonic Adventure have never seen this, too. Not that it really matters. But I just figured, hey, why not? No one's at the pool. Okay. Alright, this part, let's see. This leads up to the... Yeah, this leads to the station, which now opens up. Come on, even the even the new stand sale woman says uh, uh, goes home at night. I'm I commute too, you know. Oh, is she waiting for someone? You say anything different? Working late with no overtime. The world's so cruel. This train's heading to Mystic Ruins. Oh my dude. Oh, he's working overtime, and he doesn't get paid for it. He really needs to get a raise or something. He probably should quit. He probably should quit. It's not worth it. I never noticed that. I never knew that dialogue. Ah, my mom went to the casino, but hasn't come out yet. Oh, no. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Wow, neon lights, great music. So this is the casino that everyone's been talking about. Hmm, I wonder what that switch over there is over the sign. I always get the urge to press things like that. Oh, oops. Casino office is open. But well, the only way in is closed. Why? Why is the only way in closed? I don't understand that. Obviously, the main reason is to... Roadblock, yeah? Need light speed dash to go into Casinoopolis. 
Get the Chaos Emerald. There, we can play Pinball. And there's two forms of Pinball. The, uh, the Chaos Emerald is in this room. And what you need to do is you need to get... I think... You need to get like 400 rings. Step on the switch and little arms will grab. But yeah... Uh, we need rings. To fill, up, fill this up. Now to get rings, you know, you can go ahead and freaking, where is it? We can hit the slots and get some rings here. We can go into the shower room. There's some laying around in each shower stall. If you stand in front, you know, you can take your shower. song has been running around all day. Going in the shower with your shoes on. Sonic, you're weird. But yeah, you can get your get one ring out of here. That that that's not how you're gonna mainly get your rings. Oh my god, the freaking mm. Okay. So we can play card pinball, which is Knights in the Dreams, or we can play the Sonic Slot Pinball. Let's go into the Knights in the Dreams one. And we get actual pinball here. So I think the goal is you try to get these cards. And you need to match up a certain amount. I think you need to get some of similar colors. You can only hold like five. I keep getting in the same direction. I'm just testing this out. Another Riala. Okay. One pair. Okay, you're trying to get the same, the actual same card if possible. Okay. I only got like, what, 10 rings for that? Yeah, for a single pair. I thought this pinball machine was a lot better. It did not age well, did it? I keep going the same direction. Can I not? Can I go somewhere else? Well, we got one pair, that's for sure. I keep going the same spot. There we go. Now I'm going to different spots. There we go. Go to a different board. There's a bunch of cards here. Oh, and there's knights. So you go into the little center orb thing. So yeah, it's a nice. Uh, you get a nice knights cameo. And this is here to waste your time. Yeah, that's there to waste your time. I think that's all it's fair. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just... Fail. Oh no, the slowdown again. So, did Knights just get a job at Casinoopolis or something? Why is he here? Or is this not Knights? Is this a... I always took this as, like, an animatronic Knights. Like, this isn't the real one. Although, Knights is literally a figment of a dream, so... I don't know. So, I'm just gonna waste all of the... All my lives on this. I thought this pinball machine played a lot better. It doesn't. Okay, we're down here. 
I thought it was less than 50. So I guess if you're less than 100 rings and you failed the pinball machine, you go in the sewer. This is where you're going to get a lot of rings. This is where you're going to get most of it. If not, all, actually, you'll just straight up get all of it. So yeah, when trying to complete this place, you want to just jump into one of the pinball machines and just go straight into the sewer. Like, don't actually play the pinball in the game. <laughs> We're getting a lot of rings for this. Oh, wait. Well, let's go back. There's way more rings if we go this way. Come on. Oh, my God. That, this is a lot of rings. Nope. Oh, let me grab it. There we go. Come on, there we go. I think another 11 more will do it. Because I think it's 400. There we go. Ooh, that was nice. Charge that up. Invincibility. A shield and more rings. Uh, what? Time to climb up, climb up the ladder. There we go. Now we're in the shower room again. And we need to go this way. Step on the switch. There we go. Yeah, 400 rings. And you can get your Chaos Emerald. Yeah, not bad. Very simple if you just go straight into the sewer. Which later on, we'll have to do just that. I don't know why that just suddenly spawned here. But okay. All right, two K, <laughs> two Chaos Emeralds. Oh no, the Chaos Emerald! Oh no, you don't! Oh jeez! Eggman just used like sleeping gas on us. Eggman. Oh my! But we have two Chaos Emeralds, right? Yeah. So Eggman only got one. Okay. What happened to that emerald we just had? Uh, I guess Eggman's got one of them, but the other one's safe. I guess he didn't that know we had two. Desperate. That means his two to our one, and that's not good. That's no oh, good. Sonic, we need to get busy. <laughs> and so in GameCube version and onward, there's a cream cameo right there. Is it too late? Yeah, too late. Yeah, Cream starts... Cream the Rabbit starts flying through. That was obviously not in the original, because Cream the Rabbit didn't appear until Sonic Advance 2, which came out a little before this version. I think I saw something shiny in the alleyway. Or was I seeing things? Eggman ha actually has a big jump on us. Miss Eggrolls... What do you have to say? What? The casino? What makes you think I'd go to a place like that? I need to talk to my mom. The mom has a gam gambling addiction. Oh no. <laughs> I ne- What is with the camera? Looks like a key. Maybe I can use it in the Mystic Ruins. I'm gonna explore around and see what people say. I didn't realize this kid's mother has a gambling addiction. 
And the freaking train, uh, the guy that works at the train station is overworked. Cocoa Park was great. Tonight I'm going to the casino. Oh, I forgot to tell you, she and I are twins, but our personalities are completely different. Okay. I guess that's the explanation of why they look the same. I thought that was just lazy. Wow, what a beautiful pool. But I didn't bring my swim swimsuit. Is that it? Is there anyone else here? No? Nope. I thought that was just lazy copy and paste. No, they're twins. Okay. By the way, have you been to the casino yet? Stop by if you have time. I think he said that already. That's completely outrageous. That guy has another date today. Okay, dude. Hmm. Maybe we'll figure out what's going on with him later. By the way, as soon as we unlock Tails, we could have just quit our adventure as Sonic and played Tails' campaign if we wanted to. I've been waiting for a long time, but my dad never came home last night. It's always like this when he gets busy. I hope he comes home soon. Uh, who's her dad? Do, do we, you know? We're in love. She's the only girl for me. Oh, no. This guy's just going on multiple dates. Oh, my God. Okay. I own this building. There are many skyscrapers in Station Square, but none as big as beautiful as mine. Ha, 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 ha. How about you? Uh, it's a new day, today's paper says. A mysterious stone was discovered in the alley behind the casino. The world's full of mysteries, isn't it? Yes, I'm cur currently holding the stone. Isn't it nice? Hey, I walk in here! How rude. What do you have to say? Eventually, that girl went into the burger shop, but she seemed hungry. But now she's just standing there. Maybe she's just trying to decide what she wants. Station Square is a hub, and it links many satellite cities. Yeah, there's the statue. Finally, I'm inside the shop. Now what do I do? I'm so nervous, my heart is pounding. Oh, right, she's in love with this guy. I forgot that's what was going on. Oh, I keep talking to her. If I go here... Grr. It's not just the look. I feel a chill running down my spine. Why? Oh! There was an emblem here. I forgot about that. I forgot that was her deal. She was in love with the burger store, store guy. I forgot about that. Sure, uh, the statue in front of the burger shop goes up. Okay, she says the same thing. you say anything different? Time goes on and everything changes. Running the antique shop is my way of fighting back, I guess. Afraid of change, huh? Or respecting the pack, past. Take your pick. <coughs> oh wait, what do you have to say? <coughs> Probably at Mystic Ruins now. I wonder if he'll come back until he finds a relic. Okay, she says the same thing. What do you have to say, my dude? Once my work's done, I want to go snow snowboarding. It's a great feeling coming down that mountain. What about you? Oh, customer. I'm sorry. My mind was somewhere else. I don't think he... I don't think he got a break. I think he's still on his shift. I, I think he's still working. I don't think he actually got to go home. He's, he's somewhere else because he's so tired. He's about to fall asleep. I think that's what's happening. I don't know why, but that's opening up. 
Oh, great. Okay, I'm gonna have... The cat wants something. I don't... You might be able to hear him. I'm gonna have to take care of that. I would pause the game itself, but it pauses the music. What am I... Oh, wait. So used to having to swap it over. I don't need to do that. Uh, good, the music's fine. I'm gonna step away... Music is not fine. Can we get into a spot where the music is fine? Uh, is there a spot where the music is okay? Okay. I'm gonna stand here. Uh, I'm gonna take a second to figure out what the cat wants. BR BRB. Okay, I am back. Let me go ahead and set this back up. Alright, so we already... Yeah, we, I know where to go. Let's just talk to other people, see what they say. What do you have to say? Hey, that's it! That's my big discovery! Actually, it looks real similar. But it has some differences trying to take credit for something I found that I didn't even found. Other people found it in Station Square. But I'm just the only one that took it. I heard an island fell out of the sky. I didn't believe it at first, but come to think of it. Maybe that mountain near the station is, is the... Is the what? Huge cave appeared out of nowhere overnight. We have to look into it. Even though as soon as I came here, it burst open, but okay, whatever. It was over overnight. Okay. We're the exploration party. Part of the mountain has collapsed and revealed what looks to be an entrance. Okay, I think the other guy started going through. Eh. Come on. There we go. The rocks crumbled and revealed an entrance to a cave. The soil seems a lot like the soil from the Mystic Ruins. I guess there's different soil. I guess the soil's different. I don't know why. Okay. And we set this here, but I'm gonna go this way. No, I'm not going that way. Limit where I can go, huh? Back up here. What? Oh. Oops. I guess I had to actually see it. Land. Okay, fine. Uh, I'm gonna have to go back and grab it. I didn't know that would be an issue. I have to deal with the slowdown. Maybe I can... Maybe I can ask a friend if I could borrow uh, his HDMI GameCube converter thing and play this on an actual GameCube like I did with Pokemon Coliseum. I may have to do that if I want to play GameCube stuff. I didn't think this would be a problem. The 
Okay, now let's not mess this up. Let's not mess this up. Camera, can you please? All right, sh shoulders. Actually, change the camera. Here we go. There we go. I should have waited for it to actually open. Anything down here? Nope. Time to climb up the ladder. Oh, sorry. Sonic can't just run into it. He has to actually jump on the ladder. Ice Cap Zone from Sonic 3. Nice callback. Get the Chaos Emerald. Uh, come on. Actually, I'm not I haven't even been messing around with the chow yet, so. If we go down No, that just leads. Okay, yeah, we need to go this way. Yeah, grab uh grab these. Correctly. Perfect. Up here. And away we go. section can be pretty slow with doing this. Oh, thanks, Tails. But can we jump up there? Ah, uh, that's how we get up here. Uh, no, we don't want that. We need to head this way. None of that. Ah, uh, that's how we get here. I don't know, like, what we did to make this fall off. Oh, we jumped on it itself. Okay, I see. It's like the second one that actually we jumped on the... Okay, I see. Oh no, that small piece of wood caused an avalanche was holding the snow up. Hell yeah. You know, I'm now realizing how Sonic Adventure 1 like, the lack of a ranking system is making me, like... Well, it, it is making me explore more, but it's also making it be like, yeah, we just kind of play through casually. Whereas, if there was a ranking system, like, in SA2 onward, it's now like, oh, gotta do the best I can. We gotta go in this order, you know. Optimize my pathway. Oh, my God, the slowdown. Yeah, this is so extreme. Oh 
Come on. I know there's another one. Uh, this section, it just makes me think of a mission that's going to have to be done later. One that's notorious to be anno like being hard. Yeah, I made it to the center. There we go. Made it. There we go. Our next Chaos Emerald. Number six. I think there's a hundred and what, 120, 140 in this game? I forget. Now I think we go to the right. No. Okay. Head down here. Okay, what do you have? After studying it, I found it similar to the, str uh, the stratum. But actually, it's part of the border. There's a difference. It's pretty interesting. I have no idea what he's talking about. Who was that with the really uh, long, with the long arms and red body? I think he's headed towards the waterfall. Oh, we can do this now. Before we go and do that, I joined the expedition so I could help make some big discovery that my name would appear in all textbooks. Okay, so I know he's talking about Knuckles and he's at the waterfall, but now I want to know, what do people say if I go to Station Square? I am curious. I'm very curious on what, if anyone says anything new. They might not, because maybe the game developers just didn't think you would go back. My mind somewhere else. Yeah, I think the developers just didn't think you would need to come back. Not yet. Probably Mystic Ruins. Been waiting for a long time, never came home. He gets like that when he gets really busy. Come on, is big okay, big's still here. Guy has another day. Froggy. Okay, so I think Station Square has not changed. So I I, I think everyone's gonna say the same thing. I know I'm not being that thorough, but I think we can make that assumption. You'd think some of them would say, "I hear talk about a guy with a, a guy with that's in red is over in the Mystic Ruins," but nope. Okay, we saw him. Can I talk to the other guy, or do I do, I get too close? Uh, just throwing down fists immediately. Something bugging you? <coughs> You're gonna put up your dukes? We're gonna fight? Alright. We'll do just that. The rival fights are a joke. It's that simple. Uh, oh. oh no. 
The Chaos Emeralds. <laughs> He's been hiding there the entire time. Not even Knuckles knew he was there. Like taking candy from a baby. Okay, someone do something. He's just holding it out. He's just holding him out in the air. Someone could do something about this. This is the second time. Maybe third time. You're such an idiot. Now I have four lovely emeralds. Chaos. Yeah, we never actually saw him give Chaos the second anchor arm. Shouldn't the second arm have a silver core instead of the blue? Huh. The silver core is on the tail. Interesting decision. That's a continuity error. Oh, jeez, game designers. What were they thinking? Chaos 4. Uh, this fight's... An not annoying. Annoying's not the right word I use for Chaos 4. It's just dull. Because now we gotta just wait it out. Camera? And this is how the fight goes. It's this dull. We just gotta wait it out. And for some reason, we could just stand on top of the water. I don't know why. Come on, camera. And you know what sucks about this fight? We have to do this two other times. One with tails and one with knuckles. Oh, great. The lag. Why is this happening? There we go. Oh no, one more. Is there a way to speed up this fight? I think you're supposed to... Wait, if I charge this up, don't I deal more damage? Well, it's hard to tell now. Now, let's not have another par particle effect in involved. There we go, finally! Let me end this. Fight is just two minutes of waiting around. Where does he get the time to build all this stuff? And the funds. I guess this is a better, a, a better ship than Sky Fortress. Kind of is. 
Get to my workshop and we'll take the tornado. Hell yeah. yeah. You guys go. I have some unfinished business to take care of. No problem. Knuckles, why is your eye floating off your eyeball? Why is your pupil floating off your eyeball? I can now play as Knuckles. Uh, what do you have to say? I couldn't believe my eyes. About what? About what, my dude? Okay. Uh, we'll go over here. What do you have to say? A ship was flying in the sky. Ugh. I guess he never saw Sky Fortress. What about you, Knuckles? What's the matter? What are you waiting for? I hate this lag. What do you have to say? I was petrified. By what? The ship or us fighting? Or chaos? There are many things to be petrified over, but you're not explaining yourself. Before we go to the tornado. We were flabbergasted. What what the heck kind of ship was that? Before we go to Tails' workshop. After studying it, I found it's... Okay, so you say the same thing. We don't need to go ice cap. Is the rest of this opened up? No. All right, time to head back. I I have to know. I have to know. Does anyone say anything differently in Station Square? We'll be departing soon. I'm really debating on whether or not we want to continue this with this much lag that happens. Okay, we'll find out here in a second. Do you say anything different? Nope. Okay. I'm assuming the rest are just going to say the same thing. It's not like they saw the egg carrier, so. Alright, time to go to the tornado. Or workshop, yeah. I mean, I've been into the workshop. It's a pretty small workshop, Tails. I mean, this is all very impressive, Tails. Where are you hiding the ship, though? Where are you hiding the plane? But yes, the tornado was not in there. I was in there already. It It is not in there. Where are you hiding it? I mean, it's like the TARDIS. It's larger on... Actually, no, it's not even larger on the inside. We can go into his workshop. Also, with how small that plane is, does he even need to adjust the bomb trees? Well, time for Sky Chase. Now we get our obligatory shooter level. I guess they like Panzer Dragoon. There we go. Shoot more lasers. Lasers are chasing after them. It's taking a while. Hey, Lord Jefferson. How's it going? Um, I'm really debating on this playthrough right now. Because the slowdown is happening here and there. I am playing this on uh, Dolphin. Oh, only four charge shots. 
Missed the last stream. What'd you miss? Uh, me beating Bloodborne. That's what you missed. But yeah, this... I guess my computer just can't handle Dolphin with running everything else. Or there's just something up with this... This, uh, ROM. And so I'm kind of debating on whether or not I want to continue at least this version. It really depends on how distracting everything is. So far it's fine, but you you know when the slowdown happens. But yeah, I finished Bloodborne last week. Uh, Fire Dog took a, a few attempts, like a good five-ish. Then I spend a, a little while getting the missing weapons and uh, like the the trick weapons and the and the guns that uh, I was missing because I figured now oh, let's just do some cleanup. So I got I ended up getting every 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 gun in the game. And when it comes to the weapons, I'm mi only missing like two. Because there's one weapon you get after beating German. A Queen Yarnum? Was there another boss I missed? I was not told about another boss. I didn't do any of the chalices past that because I figured those were just kind of optional. Yeah, I, I figured the chalices were kind of optional, so I kind of didn't. I didn't do more, and there's one weapon that's exclusive to the chalices. Tails. Tails. The one at the end of the dungeon run can use a save edit to get the last chalice, or legit by going through about five chalices. Ah. Uh, You're not who I'm looking for. Yeah, I didn't know that. It, the chalices just seem optional to me. <coughs> oh, I wonder if he's okay. So I was just going through the main plot. But you can hear the slowdown. You can hear the slowdown. See, now it's normal. What do you have to say? Should I buy a swimsuit? I can't make up my mind. And the store's gonna close soon. Well, you better decide soon, lady. What's going on in here? Oh no, I'm so embarrassed. We're in love. No, you're not. <laughs> Hotel coming up. By the way, a girl with pink hair came here and headed towards the casino. And it looked like she, uh, and it looked like someone was chasing after her. Well, let's ignore that and talk to everyone else in the main square. But yeah, I got every, uh, firearm, basically, and shield. And I'm only missing two weapons from uh, two trick weapons. One is the, like the claws that you get from one of the chalices. And I wasn't bothering with the chalices. I, and one is from Elaine's quest, which I didn't even know existed. So I didn't save her, so I couldn't do that. What do you think I should say? I saw your boyfriend with another girl, perhaps. No, I can't just say that, can I? Yeah, the, uh, the couple that were in love in here, the guy that says they're in love, the day before within, you know, this game, he was on a date with another girl. This guy noticed. Not bad for a casual first time run. Yeah, so like, it only took like 12 streams. Didn't seem like it took that long. What's going on here? Are you a customer? We're on strike. We're protesting for better working conditions. May become a long battle. Oh my god, that's what's happening? 
We'll fight until we drop. We have to stand up for our rights. Uh, do good for them. Because like earlier on, we we were talk. I talked to uh, one of these guys at the train, and he's just like, I, I I work all day and I get like very little pay. This sucks. And you talk to him a little bit later. He's like, I'm still on the clock. This is overtime, and I'm not even getting paid overtime. Trains are on strike. Now my dad has no way to get home. Oh, her dad must be one of the expo explorers. But I thought she said the office job. Oh, well. There's no reason to go to the station. They're on strike now. You can't go anywhere. I mean, it's not like Sonic can't run to Mystic Ruins, but whatever. Extra, extra, a huge flying object is heading for Station Square. No damage to the city yet, but residents are panicking. An investigation is underway, and rumor has it that Dr. Robotnik is responsible. I hate that egghead. I love how everyone's calling him Eggman, even within this continuity. So, a bird flew out of the flying ship, and I think that girl with the pink hair took it with her. Oh well, yeah, uh, what's been going on, Lord Jefferson? Yeah, so I decided, uh, after a little bit of a discussion with, uh, someone else, I decided to go with Sonic Adventure because the mo- well, one and two, because the movie's coming out next month. Too nervous to even move, but that's not taking me anywhere. I gotta be brave and take another step. A girl with the pink hair was in a rush. She ran it- she ran in and out and in and out. What do you have to say? I can't believe a huge object like that can really fly. You're telling me. Let's pretend we didn't see it, okay? I don't know class for today. It's raining buckets right now, though. Oh, eh. Actually, on my end, it's not raining at all, luckily. And no, it was raining like all week. She still says the statue? Yeah, she still talks about the statue. Why was that closing? If you believe in yourself, you got nothing to fear. Okay, dude. I don't know why he wants to tell me that, but okay. Let's go to the casino. But yeah, all firearms and just missing a couple trick weapons. I, I think that was a good first, first run if you don't, uh, you know. I think that's a good idea for a first run. Uh... Yeah, the final boss itself. Uh, Germain took me like three attempts. Or is it three to five attempts? And the Moon Presence took me two. Okay, I was gonna say why the long pause. But now we can play as Amy! We can play Amy's campaign. Isn't that fantastic? Just two more to unlock. We'll fight till we drop. I don't know. I don't know much, but I do know we gotta try. Something good is bound to happen, right? Oh, and in this case, uh, this mother has a gambling problem. She left her son out on the street waiting for her. Like, he's been waiting for her to get out of the casino all night. It's it's kind of depressing. My mom wandered into the casino again. Oh no. As soon as the sun sets, I just automatically head this way. It's not my fault. My feet have a mind of their own. You are an addict! You need to get help! Any yeah, ideas for eventual challenge run cash in? Yeah, 16k. I, I don't know. That's up to you. Again, anything Bloodborne related is on the table, since I played through it. It's evening already. Rush hour will start soon. I should just go home. I don't need to go into Casinoopolis. Okay. I think I just need to go... Yeah, I need to go this way. So... Is there, like, a particular game you have in mind? 
Because, again, the caveat is I would have to personally have played it before. It doesn't mean I have to stream it before. But, like, I don't have a list available to look at or anything. Where was I supposed to go? Oh, am I supposed to just get close to Twinkle Park? I think that's what I need to do. I thought that cutscene would happen immediately, but if you get close. Okay, there you go. It's zero. But yeah, for reference, uh, Hot Corn Dog used that uh, challenge run once before. He had me play Fire Emblem the Sacred Stones, but only use basically the weakest weapons. He cannot use anything stronger. That was one thing that was cashed in. But yeah, the only caveat for the challenge runs is I have I would have to have personally played the game before. Doesn't matter if I've streamed the game before or not. Oh uh, no, the lag. Is the lag this that distracting? It doesn't pop up all the time, but at this point I'm just kind of continuing on just just cuz, but is it that distracting? Because normally I normally I don't have slow down with Sonic Adventure 1 or 2. But I think what's happening is my computer's running uh you know oh my god. The computer's running the game. The computer's running the PNG avatar on a different program. The computer's running stream avatars, which those are the little things at the bottom. And then streaming it, uh, and then actually broadcasting it. I didn't think it would be a problem. I thought it would be able to handle GameCube. But, uh, it's not really handling the slowdown. But now it's normal. So, I don't know. And the reason why we didn't have any problems for something like Bloodborne was because it was a capture card. So, the computer wasn't actually running it. And again, this is kind of my point. Like, this is why I couldn't even do Elden Ring. Like, if the computer cannot handle all this... For a GameCube game, it definitely could not handle something like Elden Ring. And before when I try when I did test runs, that was before the PNG avatar or stream avatars. It was just the webcam. I guess I'm going the normal route. I guess for the first run of Twinkle Park, I will take the normal path. Because there's some shortcuts I know what to do. But yeah, Lord Jefferson, have you played Sonic Adventure 1 or 2 before? Okay. I guess I could skip past you. No, don't target the body. There you go. Uh, don't I 
have to flip switches? No, I'm thinking of Amy. Don't know, for some reason, GameCube games on computer lags like crazy, but Starfield runs fine for you. As for Sonic, you tried it, but it lags on... So it lags so bad that it crashes sometimes. Interesting. Again, I think my computer can handle it because I've been playing Twilight Princess on my own time through this emulator, and it runs perfectly fine. So I think it's just running everything else. Is the lag that distracting? Because it's not it's not happening the entire time. But it is affecting the game a little bit. Again, normally I never have this problem, Sonic Adventure. On stream, you don't notice anything? Really? Okay. It's it's a slight slowdown. And it's definitely an audio thing, that's for sure. Right now, it's fine. It, it's not happening all the time. It happens in spots. Like right now. You, yep, right here. So, like, the music's fine right here. But then... Yeah, that's... It's not bad. You seem worse. Well, if everyone can tolerate it, then we can keep going. Yes. I'll probably just have to reevaluate how I handle GameCube, though. Yeah, not bad. Maybe what I could do is I can ask my friend to borrow his uh, GameCube well, like HDMI adapter thing. Oh shoot! I've lost and I could play at least I bet that robot hauled butt after her. at least Sonic Adventure 2 on it. I'd better catch her before it does. Because at that point it would just be a, uh, a screen capture. The other option is I tried the Steam version. But honestly, I, I feel like the same problems would happen anyway. Somebody dropped their ID card. It's from a company in that big building over there. Actually, everyone says something new. We'll fight till the end? We're on strike now. We know it's causing problems, but we're trying to protect workers' rights. You know what? Even if the trains aren't running, my dad can't come home. Dad. Okay, I think some of them are saying the same thing. Oh. What do you have to say? I'm pretty mature for my... I can stay out late. But when I tried to go into the casino, they said no. That's so rude. You're underage and it's a good idea that you're not going in. Oh, I can't go home. The trains are on strike. I have never actually talked to, like, all these NPCs. So this is kind of new to me right here. All I did, and all I did was eat a burger. Such a loser. But just going in was a big step for me. She couldn't, she couldn't uh, ask this guy out. Finally, that feeling that someone was staring at me is gone. But what was that anyway? <laughs> Anything out over here? No. What does this guy have to say? Anything new? This is the business district. It's pretty quiet at night. But at the casino, it's just the opposite. It's packed all night. She said she's saying she a creep? Maybe. Uh so she is trying to ask out this guy. But she is way too nervous to actually do it. So it was 
her being, uh, just even stepping into the building was, you know, for her just courageous. And she was just standing here, just staring like this a little bit earlier. But apparently now all she did was just order a burger. Oh, wait, what do you say? Ever snuck inside that building? The roof's high above the city, and the view up there is awesome! If you work there, you can see it anytime you want! Yeah, he's talking about this building. The guy's not here. Maybe she just loves them burgers, maybe. A weird looking robot? Yeah, I saw it. It went into that big building. Obviously, we need the ID card for that. We can't go to Mystic Ruins. I want to see what anyone else has to say. What's going? Wait, no, what's going on with... Is is the mother going to the casino again? No trains are currently in service. Oh no. Well, my mom went into the casino but hasn't come out yet. She, she, his mother has a gambling addiction. Can I fight Eggman yet? I fought him once already. Uh, we're going to, uh, not rooftop run. What was it? Speed Highway. Neon lights, great music. I don't know what to do first. Can't make up my mind. And it's already morning. She should stop. But each time she says, This time! This time! There's no way she can win, is there? What? Me? Maybe... Maybe for one last time. Hold on, do you say something? I'm broke. I, don't even talk to me right now. I have never spoken to these NPCs. I never knew there's <laughs> about all this. So you have already fought Eggman. Your nickname in boot camp was Eggman? Oh, okay. May I ask why your nickname was Eggman? Oh, wait, do you say anything different? ID cards? I find a lot of them these days. Every office worker needs an ID card. ID cards double as security cards, too. You can't get into the office without it. You look like an egg after a buzz cut, I see. You couldn't be so careless without them. Now you just need a big, bushy mustache. And, and, and be a scientist, and then there you go, you're Eggman. You're Dr. Ivo Robotnik. By the way, there is like a discussion I've been uh, wanting to talk about. I brought it up in Discord. Uh, so here's a thought. Let me let me let me uh, pose this question. Let me give me a sec. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, okay, so I was thinking about possibilities of what games to play. And oh my god, the slowdown. Oh, this is so bad. I'm sorry. Oh, now it's normal. Now it's bad. I, I'm so sorry. It's so distracting. Anyway, so I was thinking of games to play, and something popped in my head about, you know, playing games I've already streamed before. Notice I said streamed. And I won. I was thinking, like, what's a good reason to replay a game versus just not? It, uh, the slowdown's funny? Okay. Okay. Well, uh, so I was posting a discussion, and so one game, as an example, one game I streamed was the original Paper Mario. And in that one, I basically just did a 100% playthrough like I normal, but I also did badge only, or as much as you could do for a badge only run for, for Paper Mario 1. But when I played that, it was before I found out about retro achievements. So I posed one question like, is it worth going back to Paper Mario to do retro achievements even though it's basically the same run? I would say no, because it's just the same thing. But that aspect, is it worth going 
back to an existing game for something else, like, say, a randomizer. Would going back to Paper Mario as an example, if it was a randomizer, be worth going back to? Absolutely. Okay. Now, does it work in reverse? For example, I played Zelda 1 and 2, as well as Final Fantasy 1, as randomizers when I played them. Is it worth going back to and do a traditional 100% playthrough? I guess in this case with retro achievements, because I've been using it as my main... Uh... Okay. <laughs> the game was confused. I had no control. I thought it was soft locked. I love how gravity is on the wall right now. Sonic can jump off the wall and still land on the building. I didn't know Sonic has the power of gravity. That's not until the second Riders game. So, like, in. Yeah, in Zelda 1 and 2, as well as Final Fantasy 1, I did randomizers when I played those. Is it worth doing another stream of those games if it's a more traditional 100% normal playthrough? And I would probably just end up using retro achievements. Or is it just too basic of a playthrough now that I've already done a randomizer which is more interesting? Of course, the cops are chasing after me. I think they're run by Eggman, so I think there's some bias there. Each run has a different feel to it. Sometimes the most bare-bones basic runs are the best ones. Okay. Uh, there we go. We need to go ahead and... You can ring that for rings. I don't care. I'm just grabbing this. Okay. That's a thought. Yeah. Uh, the slow down. I apologize. <laughs> Again, I apologize for this. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely ask my friend if I can borrow his little HDMI thing for GameCube. And if we won't do that for SA1, we'll definitely do that for SA2. But, okay. So doing a normal playthrough, even if it's like 100% after the fact, after a randomizer run is still fine. Uh, now, my example with Paper Mario was I basically did a 100% playthrough. That's great. It's great to see it way, way worse. <laughs> okay. Probably shouldn't say anything. I'm thinking off stream, I might try on my own time, boot up a different save file and see if it runs just as bad or if it runs just fine. I think I will do that. Okay, I'm going again. Now what? I managed to get this far, but now what? Hi, sir. No matter who's staring at me, I have to do my job. Again, she's trying to ask him out. Trying to warm up the courage to ask him out. She's still talking about the, the statue. Girl with pink hair, I already talked to you. So, with my Paper Mario example, because I basically 100%ed it already, but it was before I found Retro Achievements, if I went back to Paper Mario to do another playthrough with Retro Achievements, when it's basically the same type of run, that's not worth going back to, right? I hear she lives alone in an apartment downtown. She comes to the shop a lot, but I haven't seen her today. Yeah, Amy has her own apartment. Just be the guy in the back that says, Hey guys, she can't <laughs> movies. All right, as movies. 
It's been a while since I've watched those. Hey! Kiss already! And then leave. I mean, he's as, Sonic's as fast as the speed of sound. He could totally do that. And no one would know. I just want a general idea of what we feel about playing games, streaming games I've already played before. See, the trains are on strike, so I don't have to work. <laughs> I have so much spare time now. <laughs> trains are still on strike, huh? You say anything to... We're sorry for any problems. You have any... You are having problems, right? Sorry. Finally! We got a chance to talk everything out! I just hope the two sides don't make a lot of demands. But we are willing to compromise a little. I hope the train started up again soon. I know my dad wants to come home as soon as he can. I'm the hotel manager. Uh, by the way, about those three over by the pool. I wish they'd do that someplace else. Do... Do what someplace else? Hold on. Oh! This is the guy that went on two dates! With two different girls! I don't understand why you two are so angry. Try to relax, okay? The worst part is that nobody feels guilty. Can you believe it? You've seen another girl! I can't believe this! I guess the one guy actually told the girls. This is new to me. I did not know this was the thing. This is great. Amy? Oh man, where can she be? Ah! Sonic! Help! Oh, now we can go to the Mystic Ruins. That girl must be Amy, the one who lives downtown. Sonic, please, you gotta save Amy. That is a cry for help, all right. Exactly. It is a cry for help. The train headed for, for the Mystic Mystic Ruins will be departing soon. Now the train's working. I got... They cleared things up. I have to know. I have to know. Hold on. Where's the other guy? This guy. The negotiations went well. All aboard for the Mystic Ruins. What happened? I want to know. <laughs> A lot of demands. I mean, I guess. <clears throat> he was saying that he was doing a lot of work for very little pay. And then he said that he had to work overtime with no extra pay. And, it, and then later he kind of implied that he worked all night and then had to do his next shift without a break. I want to know the details. This is the first time I've seen the train workers go on strike. The big city's a lot of fun. You call that fun? You call that fun? <laughs> Since the strike's over, what do you think? Will my dad come back soon? Who knows? Who knows, kid? Did you go to the pool? Looks like trouble. Yeah, he, he, told, he told the girls, that's for sure. Dad left for milk. He will not be missed. Oh no. Strike's over. That's great. <sighs> now he has to go back to work. It ended sooner than I thought. Normally I just move on to the next stage, but this is interesting. No, I, I didn't read it in the paper. I saw it with my own eyes. Now I could go home. Except you have to work your next shift. You you ain't going home yet. The girl with the pink hair was snatched by a robot. And it took her to the station. I'm serious. Oh, are there any more developments in here? Or is it still... Nothing's going to change if I keep going on this way. Brave. I gotta be brave. I think that's new dialogue. Hi, sir. No matter who's staring at me, I have to do my job. Okay, you're saying the same thing. Yeah, she is definitely that one nosy neighbor. And I guess the only other person to really talk to is you. And he really loves to talk about you. 
She's great, isn't she? But yeah, I've been playing Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, especially 2, for basically my entire life. For basically 20 years now. Like, these games, I can easily just go back to. Oh my god, the lag. Get in the train. Future input for Sonic? What do you mean? By the way, when it comes to Sonic games, I have played almost every Sonic game. I've played most of them. There's only a few Sonic games that I actually haven't played. Some of them are the new ones. Hey, what's happening here? Like Sonic Forces. Sonic Forces Onwards I haven't played. Uh, what else? I haven't played Sonic 06. Amy being the input. Started to use Cyberpunk lingo. I don't know. I have never played Cyberpunk. I'm assuming you mean Cyberpunk 20... What, 2077, I think, was the title? Yeah, I haven't played that one. I heard it was bad when it launched. Is it one of those games that got better over time? Well, I have to know. What do people have to say? Nope. Okay, I clipped through underneath there. Whoa. We were so shocked. That ship flew by again. It headed towards the mountains. There we go. Talk to you. That ship flew by again. Ah! Okay. Oh, wait. Can I do this now? Or is this something that I'm thinking for a different character? You know what? I think this is a Knuckles thing. Let me check. Yeah, I'm thinking of later. Different character. But yeah, I think I, I think when it comes to Sonic, I think it's a lot of the handheld stuff that I haven't played, as well. I can't imagine anyone having that much high technology. Maybe it's time I gave up archaeology. So Cyberpunk was the buggiest thing at launch, but they fixed it basically the whole game with the DLC release. Okay, so it's kind of a, uh, oh, what was it? A uh, No Man's Sky situation. Yeah, um, Amy is the type of character that wants to date Sonic, but Sonic's like, ah, oh, get away. You're weird, and then runs away. So, I think Amy Amy's chilled out over the years on the loving Sonic as much, but it's clear that, you know, she likes him. But, yeah. It flew off towards the mountains. Who the heck is flying that thing? Maybe it's an alien from another planet. Nah, I'm just imagining things. Top five favorite games? Cyberpunk, really? Huh. Yeah, side tangent. I remember when No Man's Sky was, like, announced and that was a thing. I would see it in, like, I think I saw it in, like, a Game Informer back when I actually got the magazine. And I remember seeing that. I'm like, that is too good to be true. It's not gonna work. I was right. <laughs> Well, eventually it got bad, better from what I heard, but no, I was right. <laughs> I'm like, there's no way. It's too good to be true. Did you see that flying battleship? That was cool. I wonder who made it. it flew off towards the mountains. I wonder if I should have followed it. This is what I was looking for. This is the ancient light. Try the light speed dash toward the enemy. With this, you can now do the light speed attack. Well, good to know that the lurk, lurk command works. 
I'm willing to change the text. That was just kind of the default suggestion one. But I don't know what I would put, but it works for now. And here we got the Master Emerald, which is not, it's missing some, it's not fully formed. Uh, nice to get Angel Island, even if it's a shrunken down form of Angel Island. There is another... There is an emblem down there. You need to be Knuckles. I don't think we can spawn it, though. Give him some fan- No! That'd probably kill him. <laughs> How's it going, Hawkorn Dog? Uh, yeah, uh, uh, with this playthrough, Hawkhorn Dog, there's a lot of slowdown. So, but Jefferson at least thinks it's funny, so I guess we're keeping it. But so far, yeah, sorry. There's slowdown. And I don't, that's, I don't think that's the game. That's just my computer trying to run everything. Like, I bet if I were to take off the the stream avatars and the PNG avatar, it'd probably run like normal. Yeah, what's going on, Hot Corn Dog? I'm actually taking my time with this game, uh, Hot Corn Dog, because I'm actually taking the time to actually talk to the NPCs. I know, it's something you never do at, in a Sonic game, because why would you do that? But I'm finding a lot of NPC dialogue that's very amusing. So now I have to check, and luckily there aren't that many NPCs to talk to. Playing some Dark Souls 3 because you're finishing up the magic run. That's right. See, there's the slowdown. You can hear it. Uh, yep, you can hear it. Again, I th I'm thinking after this stream, I'm going to start up a different file from fresh and see if it ru if it run if it has this problem. If it does, then I know it's the game itself. Might be the ROM because I copied this ROM myself. This is from my own uh, disc. COD Zombies lore, very nice. Uh, speaking of lore, I need to watch the some Dark Souls stuff. Or, not Dark Souls, Bloodborne. I've been, I, I've been meaning to go and watch some Dark Souls lore stuff. Oh, Bloodborne, jeez. But yeah, what's with the COD Zombies lore? Hell yeah, hot shell. Uh, what is it, Red Mountain? Soundtrack is fire, honestly, with Sonic. I know, I'm speaking the 90s. Because that's. This game is just so 90s, let's be honest. And I wouldn't change it any other way. Everything's way past cool. I think this song is like the epitome of the 90s. Like, you probably wouldn't have this beat any other time. Plus the slowdown. You know, that adds to it.
go. Right! There's prisoners here! I don't know what these things are, but they're prisoners! Wait, is this place like a, a mine or something that uh, prisoners have to do forced labor? Is that what's going on? Rumor is they're bringing back Victus Group back. Yeah, I know nothing of Call of Duty, so you're going to have to explain. Uh, I have to slow down. Oops. I, I just love slow down. Don't we all? Slowdown is the main thing of appealing to Sonic games, clearly. And, and you know what's the funny thing? Slowdown in a Sonic game is kind of normal for certain later Sonic games. It's just funny. Uh, they are part of the original timeline that was erased back in, back in Black Ops 4. Oh, so they're going to reboot that group or something. Ten emblems. Ah, ah, ah. Again, I think there's like 120, maybe 140 emblems. I forget. We're going to get all the emblems and we're also going to do mission mode. This is the GameCube version, so we'll do mission mode. I don't remember if you get emblems through mission mode. The only thing we won't really do, because it really doesn't add anything, uh, is the unlockable uh, games you can get. Every 20 emblems, we get a new unlock. But we won't play those, because there's no reason to. It's not going to complete anything. Oh, uh, the slowdown. Isn't this fun? Come on. Sky Chase Act 2. Oh, Tails repaired the other, uh... The other tornado. Okay. I just now realized that. Or... I shouldn't say now realize that, I just... Whatever. I knew that. Yeah, we're using the blue one. Not the red one. Yeah, I hope you like, uh, I hope you like, uh, shooters, like, uh, uh, kind of bullet hell shooters. Actually, this is more like Panzer Dragoon, if anything. Come on, lock on, there we go. I guess if you're not gonna make a Panzer Dragoon for Dreamcast, oh, no, wait, no, they did make it one for Dreamcast, didn't they? Well, again, Sonic Adventure, when this came out, this was kind of a way to show what the Dreamcast could do. Because some of the aspects of the different characters, when you play through them, it's really just to show, hey, uh, the Dreamcast can do this. The Dreamcast can do this, you know. So I guess making a Panzer Dragoon stage or two as like a launch thing, I guess makes sense when you do it that way. Oh yeah, now it's an X-Wing. Does it do anything new? I don't know. It's just cool. But you know the rule of cool. This is the rule of cool. Actually, I know the reason why it transforms like this. It's to sell toys. 
let's be honest here. If I if you got a little figurine of the tornado and it can actually transform like that, you know you would buy it. I would buy that. Why do you think Transformers exist? Actually, it's one of the reasons why I wanted, uh, what was that Wii U game? Um, Star, Star, was it Starling? No, it wasn't Starling. What was the one with, uh, that had a Star Fox cameo? And it lets you get the, uh, the, not the Star Fox amiibo. It gave you the Arwing amiibo. And the Arwing amiibo actually transforms to the Walker form. Oh, I actually do want that. Like, that's the only reason I wanted to get that thing. I didn't have the money for it, though. And I didn't find it when it was five bucks. <laughs> Blue Streak speeds by Sanic the Hedgehog. How's it going, Monzai? Hope you could deal with slow down here and there, because it is kind of annoying, and I apologize. Well, what's going on? So tired feeling a bit under the what? No stream today. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I mean, you get a little bit of a break. You did. Oh, did you? Uh, did you finish the navvies? Uh, on Friday. Last I checked, you were still fighting Search Man. All of them. Oh, that's all done. What else? What else is left in your red sun? Wow. This thing is really huge. No time to talk now. We need to find Amy. You're right, my friend. So here we go. Finally made it to the egg carrier. And the slowdown happens again. Again, I apologize. <laughs> Don't get too many ideas, you fools. You haven't seen the power this vessel really has. Get a load of this. There it is. Get a load of this. There's one of Eggman's famous lines. You see, Tails, my ship can too transform. You're not the only one that has watched Transformers, Tails. Yeah, Tails, it's not that impressive. You, your ship did that too. I don't know how Tails can fly. I don't know this. <coughs> how does this stop Sonic? Let alone, how's the stop Tails? Because Tails can just fly over. Like, I don't see how this stops him. Sky deck entrance is open. Yeah, because look, like... Here, let me go up here. See, all that's happened is like... Oh, wow, I could just walk up the sides right there. Yeah, there's a bunch of wind, but I could still walk up the sides. Like, I don't see the point. Just the Dark Souls Navi. Dark Souls Navi is grinding the green mystery data. The way to the sky deck. Thanks, Sonic. That was needed. Uh, grinding green mystery data in Black Earth. Getting the program advances, being duo. Beating base, duo Omega. Maybe base XX. Alright. I'm trying to remember if I did fight base xx i don't remember i might have uh i don't remember if you get anything for that but what you can do is you could probably go after duo gamma first just get that done and over with then do all of the stuff on black earth well, 
and then basically don't leave Bla don't fight Gamma or Duo Omega until you're completely done with Black Earth. Also, there's like the one HP memory that you're missing and that's in Black Earth. Only downside of doing this is a soft resetting will take slightly longer, right? Well, with Blue Moon, you basically just need to do a normal playthrough, right? Oh, I messed that up. First death of the stream. I don't know how we grab that. Oh, free tournament. Yeah, that's that's gonna be annoying. Uh, remember that when when it comes to the free tournament, I know you're not really utilizing the sending the other version exclusive navvies over. I know you're not really going to bother doing that, but if there's a particular navvy you need to fight in the finals, uh, make sure you have at least one other navvy that's not just a normal or a heal navvy. Or was it two? No, I think it might have been one other one. There we go. Oh, right. There we go. Which you had channel... Do you not have channel points? Well, also... Oh no, you I think you can do polls, you just can't bet channel points. And those would be uh predictions, I believe. Yeah, you're thinking of predictions, Monzai. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, there's more slowdown. I thought you'd be able to have channel points by now, Monzai. Thanks, Tails. <laughs> he did the work for me. saw this. I never go this way. I usually go left. Come on, let me jump on this thing. I never take this, taken this path. Okay. Come on. There we go. At least I'm getting extra lives. Come on, there we go. Get up here. Now, Sky Chase is not that fun. Come on. Oop. There we go. Don't worry, we'll, we'll get through this with no issues whatsoever. Now to destroy the giant cannon. Which... Get rid of that. No, that's not right. Oh, I could probably hang out here. There it is. 
Does it get rid of the slowdown? Nope, we still have slowdown. I just realized there isn't a score on screen. It's all added at the end. Not used to that with Sonic. I'll read that here in a second, Monzai. We're almost done. The game... Uh, the computer's trying. It's trying. Again, on my own time, I'm going to see if it has this much of an issue. Uh, okay, I failed. Go up here. It's leaning the other way. Jump on. Come on. There we go, made it. It's like, geez, Knuckles, will you knock it off? Snim. Get a little bit more progress and then fail it miserably. The game's trying so hard right now. Or the computer is. Either way, it's trying. Can I eat? Can I even make it? You know what? I probably have to go to the other side. Ah, I need to go this way. There we go. Uh, we're close to being the stage. Uh, Sonic? There we go. He was stuck. He wouldn't do anything unless I jumped. Hey, Tails, how'd you get here ahead of me so fast? Maybe Tails can beat the lag. Actually, maybe Tails is causing the lag. Nah, why bother? Jump all the way down. Press that. Then you go all... Clip through the camera, basically. There we go. The typical Sonic experience. There we go. Okay, let me yeah. let me read what was going on. Oh my god, the lag. I apologize. Very curious on what your red sun, dark soul navvies would be doing. Likely heavy on the tornado, meta gels against souls. Free tournament. Might use this break to finally beat Sonic X Shadow Generations. Is that any good? I I haven't I haven't played it because I can't afford it right now. Is it any good? The hardest fight was probably Search Man's Search. Uh, Shade Man wasn't too bad. Oh, really? Is that it? It might be, but let's check out the. Yeah, Shade Man just takes a luck. Need full synchro, double point. Video Man, okay. Okay. Counterium was super easy with counter. Okay. So Shade Man wasn't as bad as you thought it was going to be. Okay, good to know. Some password, Eggman. Jeez, his password is his own name. You should really get that fixed. We go in here, and we have access to... We have access to... Access to... The final Chow Garden! Eggman's secret base. His secret getaway. It's actually a very nice place. 
Apparently the layout of this is completely different in the Dreamcast version. I've never personally played the Dreamcast version. Oh, we can't go between. Oh, I think it's because the game doesn't want us to actually uh, go to the other areas right now. He's just a normal guy. He's not sort. Uh, he's not any sort of tech savvy super villain. Yeah, I know, right? He he needs his days off on a on a isolated beach where no one can get to. His password is actually his first crush's name, but he needed six characters, so it's Megan. Oh, okay, I see. And what is this? restricted okay so we can't access this until later none of these doors open just checking wait can you talk to the robot no I had a feeling we need to take this up I know what we got. Wait, Monsai, have you played Sonic Adventure before? Sonic! Ha, too late. I have already kidnapped the bird, Sonic. You have it on your Steam Deck? Very nice. Okay, Wait a bit. Okay. It's aged a little bit, but I still have a lot of fun with it. Wish, Maybe a lot of it's nostalgia, to be fair, but... No, out of the two, the one I go back to is Sonic Adventure 2 a lot more. Time to fight one of his robots in a rival battle. And we know how rival battles go. That's it. <laughs> rival battles are so bad. I don't, like, honestly, I don't know when they got rival battles correct took him a while, that's for sure. I can at least say that. But, yeah, uh... Step aside, Amy. Out of my way. The Knuckles fight is, uh... You know, this sound effect is where the, uh, where the game came from. Oh, no! And that was not loud at all. Do I need to turn that up? I might need to turn that up. Turn that up. I barely heard it. Good to know. I'm gonna make an omelet, Amy. I'm off to eat some breakfast. Now we can play as E102 Gamma. Uh, okay. Tails, what do you gotta say, buddy? What do you got? Okay. I'm guessing no one's piloting. Auto recovery system activated. I guess he's doing okay. What's in here? Yes! Eggman's own swimming pool! Because that's very important. You know, 
It's very important that when you have your egg carrier, you need to add your swimming pool. No buts, it's the rule. Can't really do anything else in here. Okay. We can't go... Oh, no, we can go back down. No reason to, I don't think. We need to go in... Okay. If I'm to continue, I need to change this ship back to its original shape. Thanks, Sonic. Thanks for there telling must me. There be a switch somewhere on the bridge. I've got to find it now. It's not like I was trying to do that. Thanks, game. Thank you. Can you go into either of these rooms? No. Okay. Up here we get the captain's seat. I shall pilot the ship now. And of course the switch is underneath the chair, but wasn't it pressed the entire time if it was underneath the chair? Now we can take shortcuts. Ah, uh, slow down. Don't you love it? Where are we? Oh, is Amy and Tails here? No, they all left. Okay. Oh yeah, Sonic can take these cannons! Where does this lead me? Up here, but there is nothing. Does one of them have a different height? No, they both lead here. Okay. Well, it's time to catch up to Eggman. Head up here. I caught you, Egg Face! Oh, look, Chaos has six emeralds already. When did that happen? Oh, no! Not again! Chaos! Could this be the same beast? <laughs> oh, yes! Attack Sonic! No! Shaggy? And Big the Cat's I here. Hi, Big! If he's your friend, Why are you I'll even help. here? Just leave it to me! No, it's Mad Egg, Sonic. Just one more emerald, Sonic. Then I can make Eggman land. Chaos 6. There we go. Oh no, he's a Kirby. He can try to eat me. It ain't gonna work. Come on, Egghead! Just like normal, Eggman! You- you are the own- a cause of your own demise! I can't believe this! Uh, Sonic? Okay, there we go. I messed that up. You deal more damage if you do the light speed attack. this. There we go. I think it could be done in two cycles if you use the light speed attack. There you go. Done. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. Maybe when you get your final chaos emerald. There we go. 
Yeah, that's the same Monzai with Sonic Adventure 1. This game was really meant to be like, hey, let's show what the Dreamcast can do. So that's why a lot of the characters play differently. So like the reason why we kind of have the treasure hunting stuff for Knuckles kind of shows what the Dreamcast can do, although less so. The reason why Big's here, to show the fishing mini game, to show what the Dreamcast can do. And I think the Dreamcast version is actually compatible with the Dreamcast fishing, fishing rod. Peripheral? Peripheral, yeah. So I think that's what it's used for. You got Gamma shooting stages. You got the Panzer Dragoon, like, tornado areas. You got the snowboarding sections. This game was just almost, almost like a tech demo of what this is capable of. Uh, I hate Eggman. Yeah, that's what it was made for. It was specifically used for the peripheral. I don't know why we can enter the ruins now. Now that I'm thinking about it. I don't know why it's opening up. trying to show me something oh is it is, is it to call telling you to go in is that the reason okay that was something we did but no it, it, it's kind of seeming like that's to call telling us to go in and she opened up the way um there's a few things to explore around here i think there's some adventurers where's the map yeah, there's the map. Let's explore around and talk to people, see if anything is, uh, anything different was said. Come on. I, I really hate exploring, uh, the jungle. Easily get lost. Well, here's Big's house. I mean, if you could call it a house, but hey, he's okay with it. Um, there is a little, there's like two little caverns. I think we went this way. Did I find it? Yeah, I'm on the right path. Oh, hi. I've been in the jungle for months and my wife is in Station Square. I'm so lonely without her. Oh, is this the dad? <laughs> the reason why he hasn't come back is because he's been lost for months? Is that what's happening? Oh, yeah, okay. Nothing here. Probably, I'm think, thinking ahead to a different character. There was another little uh, side area to check. Oh, another one. I've been an explorer for 25 years. And my sixth sense tells me I'm close to what? The temple? It's nearby. I don't know how I have a map and you don't. Because, dude, the temple is right over here. Just turn around. Turn around. It's right here. I feel like these explorers are just wandering in circles and be like, hmm, why didn't you try going a different direction? Uh, okay, that, these sections I can't do anything at. Okay, I wasn't sure. Let's see if I can leave. Uh, okay, I can't do this. Wait, entered the jungle that never ends. Oh, but it's cool. You better be careful. There's one guy that's been lost for months. You should really put some signs. You know? Wait, can I leave? Hold on. Okay. 
Let's see if anyone else has anything to say. Is there anything new? Station Square. Since the first party still hasn't returned, we're gonna send out another party. I hope they're okay. They've been lost for months. Uh, the other guy's not here. Is the one guy over here not anymore? That's what the other search party was for. Oh, yeah, I don't own a Dreamcast, so I never played the original version of this. Basically, this GameCube version is how I'm, uh, how I played through Sonic Adventure many times. The second party head into the jungle shortly after the first party, but since they didn't pick me, I had to stay behind. Can I go to Station Square? Come on. Do you say anything different? Better get back to work. Thanks for taking the train. Well, it's a good thing you got all your, uh, all your workers' rights situated. If the strike's over, I guess I have to go back to work. Actually, are people saying different things? Hold on, I, I'm getting double check. Never thought I'd see a ship falling from the sky, or even one that's flying, for that matter. There's sure a lot going on in this town. Her dad's back! Dad's home! Dad's back! This is great! This is my wonderful daughter. She keeps me young and optimistic, no matter how old I get. She's been waiting for you for days now, dude. You need to get away from work more often. Husband's an adventurer, probably still at Mystic Ruins. I wonder if he's figured, find any ancient artifacts yet. Okay. I think she said the same thing before. I don't think that's new dialogue. Bigger is better, that's what I think. Yeah, you're gonna make your building taller or something. Did you see it? Did you? Robotnik's flying fortress fell into the ocean. The city's in danger. C the city in danger. Saved. How was that for a headline? Be like, well, it was saved by me. You should do an interview with good old Sonic. My mom looks depressed lately. I wish she'd get back to her normal self. Is this the... Is this the mother with the gambling addiction? Is that the same kid? What's going on here? Well, uh, well, um, I just, I just can't do it. I can't even talk in front of him. What? You don't see many customers who are too nervous to buy a burger. She is trying her best to ask him out. She is trying her best. Do you still say the... Yep. You don't change dialogues. A quiet shop that doesn't attract many customers. Customers, But I like it just the way it is. So you don't like actually having a successful business. Okay. Let's take a look around uh, the, the hotel. But... I should be able to go to each of the Chow Gardens now, I believe. Hotel manager, call me anything. By the way, are you... Are your Chow... How are your Chow? Are they growing? They're so sweet. I haven't messed with them yet. But we're gonna need to. This resort is full of fun. Ships falling from the sky. Robots roaming the streets. This town is crazy. Well, I don't want to go in there. I'm not going to the Emerald Coast. Station Square is a pretty exciting place. Gotta go home, but I, I, I sure hope I can I could come back. Anyone else around here? Nope. Okay. I have to know. Is the mother still in the casino? It, it, it's not that I thought you were so great. I was just so lonely, and I couldn't stand being alone. Wait. What are you saying? Don't expect too much. If you got high expectations, you'll just be that much more disappointed. 
Oh, this is the guy talking to the girl that was she was dating the yeah, the one guy that was dating two girls. Okay, I see what's going on. Oh, the, okay, yeah, that other kid. Yeah, that that's the same kid talking about his mom who has a gambling addiction. Okay, it's been so noisy around here lately that I can't even take a quiet walk. Dude, you're at the casino. Of course it's not going to be quiet. If you want quiet, go to Mystic Ruins. Speaking of Mystic Ruins, time to head back. Yeah, if I wasn't uh, talking to every NPC, we'd probably be done with Sonic's story by now. <laughs> Wait, oh, I wonder if there's more, uh, more people over here. What do we got? Is there another adventurer over here? Or are they all in the, in the jungle? Yeah, I don't think anyone else is over here. No, I don't think so. Master Emerald is still broken. Knuckles, what did you do? Okay, now we'll head back to the jungle. We'll ho we'll head into the ruins. We're missing another special egg that's on the egg carrier, but you can't get that unless you play as... Well, not Sonic. You know, they had to enter the minecart here, so they know about the ruins. They're just kind of stupid and not able to get over there. There we go. The spin dash jump is so good in, in these two games. Lost World. Honestly, not my favorite stage. If it's not my least favorite, it's down there. I don't know why. I think aesthetically this is nice, but I'm not really a fan of actually playing through the stage itself. I don't know why. If I remember correctly with this game, Sonic is able to play through every stage in the game except for one. There's only one stage that Sonic does not actually enter. Of course, because it's Sonic, you know, we gotta give him access to almost every stage. You know, we gotta play favorites. Whereas every other character has at most six stages. Or as low as three. Yeah, this section takes a while. Just have to wait it out. And press this. There we go. Two more to go. I hope you like Labyrinth Zone. Because that's what this is reminding me of. And with the slowdown, it definitely is Labyrinth Zone. What? If I can run over... There we go. Oh, I failed. I thought he, I thought the snake would get closer. Well, I, I got an extra life to replace the one I just lost. So, you know, it, it was worth it. What? Well, uh, not really, but oh well. Thanks to call. Not like I didn't know that already. 
You know, I, I knew about that to call. Thank you. Thanks for reminding me. Totally needed. Do this all over again. Wish I could skip to that, but nope, you can't. Come on, snake. Get over here. I'm not gonna run around to get those balloons. Not worth it. Besides, once you get them once, that's it. Come on. There you go. Well, this room is definitely one of the reasons why I don't like this stage, that's for sure. Oh, okay. If you want to save time, you want to go over here. Do that. Now we gotta wait for the snake. Are we gonna find a weapon that surpasses Metal Gear in this place? We already got a snake. And it's very solid. But it is submerged in some liquid. The snake is taking his time, you know. There we go. Right, light sources to light up the place, because you can't see, except... You can totally see a little bit in front of you. Hope you like darkness! And slow down. Go through here. Here we go. See, you don't need to light up, light everything up. Take the springs. And now we gotta do it indie. We got we gotta pull Indiana Jones where we run from a well actually he didn't really run from a boulder, but still. There we go. Made it. Oh my god, camera, please. But uh, one thing about these stages is that they're built with multiple characters in mind. So that's why we kind of have an open era area right now. Because eventually when we play as Knuckles, he's going to be exploring this section. And he does a lot of... Uh, he explores a lot of open areas to search around. So I, I feel like because this game has to... The stage design has to accommodate for multiple characters. I feel like the stages themselves are not at their full potential. But I guess you could also view it as because they have to accommodate for multiple characters at a time. It's well designed with that limitation, I guess. I don't know. Uh, Sonic Adventure 2 doesn't really have that problem. But actually, now that I'm thinking about it, it's not really a problem with the de stage design. It's a problem with the fact that almost every character plays differently and has a different gameplay style. Look at you, big.
down here. Here we go. Yeah, if we could just make it into this little alcove a little sooner. Just do that. Speed through. And we made it. Uh, wonder if they'll bring back Fetish, if, if the rumors are true. The way they met each other was circumstantial and at best. Either A, they're bringing back the ones from the original universe, or just going to be a random T called Victus. I see. Yeah, not bad. But the question is, are they going to do similar characters and similar storylines with those characters? I, again, I haven't played Call of Duty, so I wouldn't know if that even matters, but... Or are they just going to be completely brand new characters that just steal the name? And it makes you wonder why they're even called Victus at the same in the first place. Wow, what's this? A mural. You know, since uh, the third Sonic movie is coming out, and we're kind of skipping over Sonic Adventure 1, uh, it makes me think of like how they could incorporate Sonic the story of Sonic Adventure 1 what if they were to place? do a Sonic 4. Where am I? And this I think really it, there would be an easy segue, but... It, it, I do find it weird that we are skipping uh. SA1. For Sonic 3, it just feels like they desperately want to just introduce Shadow, which, I mean, I don't blame you, but. But actually, here's a further question. If they make a Sonic 4 and it's an adaptation of Sonic Adventure 1, would they shoehorn Shadow into the plot? Because, Grant, you can make Shadow skip a movie and still work, but, you know, do the Sonic Heroes movie as movie five. Why? Why does this have to happen? It's terrible. I must stop this now. Sonic's like, I don't even know what's going on. Who are you? And there we go. Wow, that was trippy. What was that all about? Again, I think I'm dreaming here. Sonic gets no context for this. Actually, none of the characters really get context of what's going on in the past with to call. Eggman. So what's he doing here? Well, never mind. This time I'll get him good. Oh, uh, let's see. The team in the original universe met post moon. Moon's quest is sending all the nukes from the moon towards the earth, causing the end of the world. Hmm. So the plot would be different at the very least. There would be no reason. When did that get here? That was not here before. I know I didn't really show it off, and I should have, but that wasn't there before. I mean, I have to talk to the other people and see if anything changes. I would think one text box in Station Square would probably be enough to figure out if anyone says anything different. Because I doubt they would know what's going on over here. Actually, they might say something else. Now I'm thinking about it. Now I'm curious. Okay, what do you say? First party still has a return. We're going to send out another party. Hope they're okay. Okay, so you say the same thing. I don't think you were here. I'm really interested in this strange mountain, but we got to continue looking for the ruins. 
I mean, you know the runes are there. It's not hard. Uh, second party had his general. Okay, so they say the same thing. However, what I want to check is Station Square. Because, supposedly, there could be dialogue here. I doubt it, though. I doubt there's going to be dialogue. There's only, like, only a couple spots I could check. I'm not going to check everything. Do you say the same thing? Dad's home. Yeah, okay. It looks like everyone here is saying the same thing because they don't... They don't know what's going on in Mystic Ruins. Might as well take this boat. Somehow, uh, we know where the egg carrier is, and there's a boat specifically to take us there. Yeah, the egg carrier is just floating in the water right now. And take this raft to the Mystic Ruins. Because why not? The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. I know it took me a long time to figure out how to go back to the egg carrier when I first played. Alright. Let's head to Eggman's base. But seriously though, Sonic Adventure 1 and 2... Uh, the spin, ja spin dash has never been better than these two games. <laughs> With what you can do. Are you still saying you've been... What do you say? No matter how far we go, the jungle just never seems to end. When I entered the jungle, I could have sw sworn I saw them. Where could the ruins be? I mean, you're not mistaken. It, it's clearly... Dude. Dude. Get over here. He turns around, you fool! <laughs> you idiot! Honestly, getting the loss for a month is on them. Or months, I should say. That's on them. I can't help them. Camera, what are you doing? Let's go into Eggman's base. And here we get a robot of... I... That's not Metal Sonic. Uh, I think that's Mecha Sonic. No, wait, hold on. There's Metal Sonic. Sonic CD. Is this supposed to be Mecha Sonic? No, this is something else. And honestly, this robot never comes back. Never gets referenced, I don't think. Go down here's nothing. Anyway. You think Eggman would lock the doors? You know, so no one else can get in. Uh, we want. It's one of these puzzles. Uh, here we go. Made it. Now for the final stage. Final egg. At least the game knows. Get to the center of the base. You know. Gotta get past the laser. So... I got a question I've been asking this entire time, but is the lag that distracting? I could I could see if I I can borrow the well eight GameCube HDMI adapter from a friend 
And at the very least, when we get to Sonic Adventure 2, we can play through that. Hell, if I get it soon enough, if I'm able to borrow it quick enough, I might just play the game a little bit on my own time and catch up to where I am. I don't know. How do we feel? Is it that distracting or is it more funny? Just to see how bad the slowdown can get. Yeah, see, the lag is already getting distracting. But again, maybe it's funny. I don't know. I would think it would just get annoying. But yeah, here I am still playing. I mean, I guess I'm, I'm still able to play through the game. life because there's one right here Time to go this way I don't know why the platform raised up now that I think about it oh well Eggman, what is the purpose of this room? Now that I'm thinking about it, like, what is the purpose of this? What does this serve? I mean, Eggman can fly through if he's in his little egg pod thing. Wait, did I? I knew it! I knew it! I fell through! So, on that little elevator, once you step on it, you get locked into place until you get to the bottom of the elevator. However, you can fall through the sides. So that's what happened. Apparently, when I stepped on the elevator, I didn't step on it in the right spot. So I fell through the side. Camera, please, please. I know we haven't messed with the Chow Garden at all. Probably should. But I, I guess we need to make a decision on what Chow to use. Because we gotta, we gotta have our main Chow. There we go. I'm safe. Yeah, I can't control Sonic. But because of that, that's why I fell through. And you think it wouldn't matter, but I guess the game just has to load the... Next section, that's why. Yeah, you can't just fall through, fall down, even though that's something you should be able to do. No, you hit the death plane. I probably shouldn't. Okay, there we go. Great, another elevator. to get through as yeah as we're gonna see later this section is gonna be used with gamma so some of the layout is gonna be weird 
Don't worry, I'm using the light speed attack. It's just normal for the camera to be wonky. That's that is normal. There's actually no point. You better you're you're better off climbing the ladder. They'll just respawn. Oh, come on. I thought it jumped. Fine, whatever game. I don't care. I don't even know what's down there. Like, I don't even know what that is. You tell me. Oh, hold on. What is up there? Come on. And... I know we're close. Come on. We're it. Well, it's a good thing I have the, the green shield. Uh, okay. There we go. Go up here. Take this path. We end up into another pit. Where... Where's the ladder? Come on. Where is it? Oh, no. Not a ladder. We gotta go through... Get past the lag and go through this door. Yeah, this section is where we play as Gamma. See, there's a bunch of like Tails dolls, Knuckles dolls, Sonic dolls that Gamma will have to shoot later. We'll get there, we'll get there. Oh, I made it. <laughs> I'm like. Uh, slow down. Chat, is this really annoying? Is the slow down really annoying? Because I, I could totally ask my friend to borrow... Borrow his little adapter. I would love to get one for myself, but they, they're pretty spendy. There we go. Now you must climb up the tower to fight me, Sonic. While I destroy my own base. It's nice of Eggman to have rockets placed about this place. Here we go, the Egg Viper. And chat. There it is, get a load of this. Get used to that. Why? What is the point of that, Eggman? You're just trying to taunt me, and it's backfiring. Load load 
I, I don't know why he thinks that's a good idea. Why did I think that was a good idea? Sonic, I blame you! Just kind of keep running back and forth. Okay. I never tried light speed get attack for there. I wonder if it would work. Maybe I should try it. But first. See if this works. Oh, it does. Uh, but um, it doesn't launch me to the other side. So no, it doesn't work. <laughs> Good to know. It probably dealt more damage. I'm not sure. Well, now I know. Actually, since this one might be a safe attack. No, it's not even a safe attack. And even then, he, he still only takes one health bar's worth of damage. Never mind. It's not worth it. Okay. Definitely do not do light speed attack. Like, don't do that. That's how you die. And I'm pretty sure this Eggman model is, like, it's still his... Like, uh, still his original Dreamcast one. Because I think the model, his normal one, got updated. But this one is still his Dreamcast one. I think that's how it works. Or maybe it always looked like this. I'm not sure. Laser. I had a feeling I was going to get hit there. Camera? Okay. Go ahead and do your lasers. You know, I think if this game had maybe a little bit more time. Because I think this game might have had to been rushed a little bit. Maybe with a little bit more playtesting, someone would have realized, Oh, a light speed attack would just make you die during this. Yeah, Eggman, this is all on you. You could just keep shooting lasers at me. And just never expose yourself. But no. You're the one that wants to expose yourself. See, this is all on you. Like, I... The only one you can blame is Eggman. Like, he can only blame himself. And I'm dead. <laughs> oh, he got me. I should have, uh, like, homie attacked or something. 
get some more speed. I thought how that worked was because I was standing on the one platform for the whole time. I thought he would lock onto that platform. But I think he followed me a little bit. Yeah, it might just be best to keep moving next time. Okay, Egg Viper is not that bad. Oh, uh, we're almost done. Go ahead, shoot your laser. Let me go to the other side. What the? <laughs> okay. Whatever game. I don't know what happened there. Man, Eggman's actually winning. <laughs> Granted, it, some of these wins were because Sonic was like, Ah, oh, I'm gonna try something on you, Eggman. I'm gonna see if this works. Oh no, it doesn't. And other times, you know, Egg Eggman actually just got me that one time. And this one, I don't even know what happened there. Just, I think the world just glitched out on me, Eggman. You win this round. Shoot your laser. There you go. I think we're doing the... He flies over the... Platforms. Yep. There we go. He's not exposed, so you can't actually attack him there. I was thinking about it, but no, I don't think you could. Alright, Eggman. Throw your spike disc at me. Throw your Beyblade. I just realized Eggman's into Beyblades now. Why do you think he put it on the side of his sh of his Viper? Best for me to just Watch out. There, we up for something. there we go. It's it's just it's that simple. Yeah, just hey, kinda start moving to the other that? side when Takal says he's up to something. Okay. That simple. That fight took way longer than it normally would. Oh no! Egghead got away again! Oh hey, Tails, you survived the landing!
My Tails has been gone for a little while. I think at this point... I think the lip syncing is supposed to go with the song. I think that's what was happening, because I don't know what else Sonic would be saying there. And there was part of Sonic Adventure. We got through Sonic Story. It took a lot longer than I should have, but let's be honest, I was because I was talking to all the NPCs, that definitely killed a lot more time. But hey. I, I, I found out one of the one of the character one of the NPCs is addicted to gambling and just uh, leaves her child alone. Like it's depressing. <laughs> Anyway, um, so I think what we might do is, I don't think we're going to start any other character yet today. What we may do is maybe play a stage or two and work on our chow. Never stop gambling. The grind never ends. That's, dude, some of the NPCs are saying that. They're, they're basically like, uh, one of the characters. One of the NPCs is like, I, I keep telling her to stop, but she keeps saying, Gotta try again. I try again. One more time. I think I might need to do that. But it's like, oh my god. <laughs> What's with these NPCs? But yeah, I think, I'm thinking of... We'll start one of our chow. Because we need... We need a good uh, chow being raised. So we're going to have to do some... Uh, we're gonna have to repeat stages to get animals. We got two of the three special eggs. We can't get the last one unless we play, like, Gamma or Amy, but that's fine. But we can hatch all the eggs we currently have. But we need, we need to decide who our main Chow is gonna be, then. What, what Chow are we gonna use? Because honestly, uh, SA1, SA2, like the Chow system was a genius idea to implement. Like, uh, more so in Sonic Adventure 2. Because what it did was, you have your Tomogachi, you play the stages over and over and over again to get material, you go back to the Chow Garden, raise your Chow up a bit. Oh, you need to, ra you need to raise power a little bit more? Go back into the stages that are fun for you and then just keep and just keep going back and forth. Green Chow? Hmm. That might be difficult to do, because we'll get there in a second. I'm pretty sure this song is going to be hit by some sort of copyright. I'm actually curious on how many of these songs might get hit, if, at, if any at all. But, yeah, we're going to have to... We're gonna have to find a shot. When was Big in the freaking lobby? When was he there? I'm pretty sure I was more or less thorough. He was never in that lobby. Oh yeah, no, like, I wish they kept the Chow Garden in future games. Because, to me, it encourages replayability. But I, I can understand why some people wouldn't like the Chow Garden or don't like the fact that if you 100% it, it is mandatory. But the cool thing about the Chow Gardens is, one, they are separate saves. You could de delete your main save file, start the game over, and you still keep your Chow. Uh, and two, at least with Song Adventure 1 and 2, uh, there are ways to transfer your chows between games. So if I started with Sonic Adventure 2, like I did, and I already built up a good chow, I could just transfer the chow from SA, SA2 to SA1 and just use that chow to get all the emblems that I need and not have to build up another chow. So I always thought that was really cool, but they never built it. They never really built upon the Chow Garden past SA SA two. And I think there's a way to do it nowadays. They just say it just doesn't do it. Uh, 
Okay. So yeah, we might play a stage or two. Let's take a look at the Chow Garden. Now that I have beaten uh, Sonic's story, we can fully explore everything. And because Sonic has the most stages, there's a lot more options. So yeah, we want to venture. We'll pick Sonic. Okay. Time to go into Chow Garden. Come on, love. Okay. So we have a bunch of normal eggs. We have like six because we can go to a carrier mystic ruin so we have a total of six normal eggs we also got the silver chow egg that was from mystic ruins you only get one of these per save file not chow garden save file just per save file you could delete the you could delete your game or start on a different file and get another one of these and we got the gold egg that was in the uh the antique shop so we can have a gold chow we have a silver chow. We we didn't get to see it, but uh, in on the egg carrier there was a black chow. But let's see if we go into the black market. We have the options of a white chow, a yellow chow, or a pink chow. I why is it glitched up? Why is the text glitched up? Okay, it's fine now. Okay. Your fruit, dark fruit, heart fruit, round, cubicle, apple, cardboard box, mushroom. At the moment, we can buy either of these eggs. But if we want a different colored egg, I think what we need to do is... Yeah, he says changes periodically. So I think we would need to play a stage come back and see if the see if it changes out because if I were to go back in right now yeah it's this it's the same list and with chows there are a lot of colors but the main reason why we're gonna be building chow or raising chow because you got the Chow races. We need to raise Chow stats so they can compete in the races. I think first, let me go ahead and at least hatch. Uh, on. Pick and hold, and then you can shake the egg. Yes, yeah, shake the egg. You know, that's not gonna cause problems. Then we can put it down. There we go, the egg's hatching. There we go! Our silver chow. We can name it. It has no stats, but as you can see, we got swim, fly, run, power, and stamina. Stamina is usually the hardest to build up, but the others we can max out very easily. Oh! One of the other chows hatched our. Oh, wait, no, that's just a visual glitch of the water. Never mind. I thought the ch chow hatched. I'm at least gonna hatch these two. Let me see if I can find a list of different chow eggs. Okay, Sonic. Adventure. And there we go. We have our gold chow. And just to show off, I'll hatch one of the normal ones. I am going to throw this other one just in Mystic Ruins for now. Adventure one. Chow eggs. Let's do that. Keep the spares somewhere else. Come 
on. Where's the mouse? Okay, where's the other egg? Here it is. Now, I don't want the secret chow eggs. I know about those. I need... Oh, yeah, this is what Chow normally look like. Kind of this light blue with a yellow... Yellow tip highlight. Keep one of each for now. Uh, let me see if I can find a list. Let's try looking up... Okay. Power Chow are the most common, as they are the easiest to obtain. The very first Chow you start with is a special kind of colored Chow, referred to as regular two-tone Chow. Every colored Chow has a single base color. Better get going. Whatever, Sonic. They may often appear to visually have multiple colors on their bodies, but this is an effect resulting from two other factors in the breed. Colored Chow are only ever one base color out of available 14 which could be anything from regular white, red, blue, yellow, pink, purple, sky blue, orange, green, brown, gray, lime green, or black. But then there are the special chows with the silver and gold. Mono two-tone are the easiest type of chows to obtain. They can be purchased as eggs from the black market. You might expect mono tone chow appear as a solid color all over the body. So it's saying when we buy an egg, if we buy, say, that yellow one, we could have a yellow chow that has no other tones. Kind of like this, where it's just a single color. Or if we bought the yellow egg, it could have a different tone. Kind of like how this one has the yellow tip. There is also Jewel Chow. They are rarer, and they have a metallic reflective coat. They cover in jewel-like sheen. They do not show the Chow's base color and tone. Instead, all Jewel Chow appear with a solid metallic uh, texture. Every Jewel Chow has a single jewel coat, which defines the appearance. The variable types are non-jewel. I'm pretty sure that just means anything that's not a jewel one. You got silver and gold, which we hatched those just now. Those are Jewel Chow. Ruby, Sapphire, Amethyst, Emerald, Garnet, Aquamarine, Peridot, Topaz, or Onyx. There's also Shiny Chow, which are the same and have a sparkling, brighter coating. They can be, All Chow can be shiny or non-shiny version if the Chow has a non-jewel coat. The Chow will look the same, but more sparkly and shinier. If it has any other jewel coat, it would appear differently depending on its original base color and what version of Sonic Adventure 2 you're playing. Sonic Adventure 2, okay. And if you're playing GameCube, semi-transparent or completely invisible, with a few being opaque. If you're, pre if you're playing PC, all opaque colors, Steam, Xbox 360, PS3, there are no shiny jewel chow. Okay. So a list of Chow in each game. Blah, blah, blah. I don't need that. Oh, Bronze and Onyx Jewel Chow are from breeding. Yes, Chow can breed. There, this system is very deep. And honestly, if I'm correct, we still don't know everything about how Chows work. They're still like trying to delve into the code and we still don't know everything. Moon Chow are unique Chow with special appearance. It's a purple and almost golf ball-like texture covering it. Like Jewel Chow, solid color, doesn't show the Chow's normal color. The Moon Chow is only available on the online black market. Unattainable through any other version of the game without using... Oh, right! I forgot! In Sonic Adventure 2 on the Dreamcast, you got your normal black market, but the Dreamcast was able to connect to the internet. And I guess there was an online version of the black market. So I guess there were exclusive chow for that. Again, the Dreamcast was ahead of its time. It's too bad the PS2 
play DVDs. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, Jewel Chow, unattainable directly in the game, in fact. The only way to get Jewel Chow, Chow is to own the GameCube game. Oh, they transfer it to Sonic Adventure DX or Tiny Chow Garden. All the versions have no other way to obtain Jewel Chow without mods. Yeah, so to, the only way to get Jewel Chow is to play Sonic Adventure 2. If you're playing on any version past the original Dreamcast, I guess. And even then, I don't even know if it can connect to the internet. So yeah, we don't have access to Jewel Chow, but they are in the game, technically. Let's see. No Tutorong Chow in this version of the game, except for the regular colored one. Not all Jewel Chow are attainable directly in the game. You could tame silver and gold eggs. But to get the other colors, you need the GameCube version, so you could transfer them over from Tiny Chow, Tiny Chow Garden from SA2, right. So it seems like our we have we still have plenty of colors to get from with Chow. I guess that's the question. What color Chow do we want? Do we want to use one of the silver and gold ones? Do we want to just use a normal Chow? Or do we want to try to go for a specific color? Hold on. What was the list? So from what I from what I'm reading, I'm gonna go over it again. White, red, blue, yellow. Pink, purple, sky blue, orange, green, brown, gray, lime green, or black. And if we're going with black, we can get the one. Get the one in the egg carrier later. You jinx the chow. Dude, like, chow's like is. You can do. There's so many things you can do with chow. It's honestly, if. Although, if you're gonna mess around with the chow garden, you're better off playing Sonic Adventure 2. Because there's more you can do there and things are a little bit easier. Wait a minute. I just thought of something. If I continue, no matter which version I play, whether it's Dolphin or if I'm actually going to play off the actual GameCube, we can transfer Chow between versions. At least I'm pretty sure you can with the emulator through Tiny, Tiny Chow Garden. We could just build one Chow. Better get going. And just use the Chow in both games. Or would it be better to just build two Chow? One for SA1 and one for SA2. I'm going to do one level of Emerald Coast. But yeah, in SA2, you can see how... Uh, each stat has a... Each of the Chow stats are born with a ranking. Oh, we're doing Mission 2. Right. I don't actually need to do Mission 2. I just want to gather the animals. Fine. The mission is very simple. I wasn't planning to do the other missions right away. I was going to save them for later. But if we happen to complete it, we happen to complete it. I am being dead serious that they Sega could just make a Chow game, and it would sell. You know something before? I'm not talking about what was it? Battle game or something? Uh, I think I asked. Uh, is the lag this distracting? If it's possible, I could ask my friend if I could borrow his GameCube HDMI adapter and I could just play off the GameCube itself and it would be a screen capture thing. Would would that be better or is the or is the lag funny? To see how just to see how bad this lag can get. Because I could ask my friend if I could borrow his HDMI adapter. And if I do that, I'll just play Sonic Story on my own time. I'll just replay the plot. It won't take that long. What the hell? I have... 
never seen that. And did the game... Hold on. Oh, I paused the video on my end. Okay, I was a little confused. I'm like, why is it frozen on my laptop? No, I guess I paused it. To be fair, you ain't watching all the time during this. You're busy only talk when you're standing so far again. Ah, uh, okay, so... I'm getting the vibe to just keep going with this. You either find it funny or just deal with it. Okay, we can keep this going through emulator. But again, different question. Kind of secondary. Uh, what color chow do we want? And since I'm also planning on playing SA2, like, probably back to back. The other option is we can skip the Chow Garden in Sonic Adventure 1 and go to Sonic Adventure 2, build the Chow up there where we have plenty of more options to work with, and then, like, build the Chow in SA2, bring it here to get the rest of the emblems. Or do we just want to build a Chow in each game? try to do a shortcut. There we go. Yeah, if you really want to boost swimming, you go to Emerald Coast. There's a lot of swimming, uh, a lot of animals that boost swim. Some run, like the bunnies, but mostly swim stuff. But no, seriously, my idea for, like, bringing back the Chow Garden in current day, we could kind of take from Pokemon Home a little bit. Yes. What we can do, what Sega could do, is have basically a tiny Chow Garden as a mobile phone app. And you could do certain things to take care of your Chow on your phone. And maybe, like, you know, you could do some of the... Like the kindergarten stuff to let it learn certain tricks or give it certain outfits in that tiny chow garden. Then each game that comes out, you have its own chow garden. Then you could transfer your chow from the tiny chow gar garden on your phone app to whatever the new Sonic game is. And maybe that new Sonic game gives access to that chow, like new instruments to play, new mini games to play. Kind of like the ribbon challenge with Pokemon sort of thing. And you have the mobile app kind of be the main hub. But no, Sega doesn't like good ideas. Do we have a different set of eggs to buy? No, it's still the same. How do we refresh this? Oh yeah, what's the feeling for Chow Garden? How do we change the black market? Originally, the black market was only accessible online via in-game web browser. Oh, I didn't know that about the Dreamcast version. Get going. Chow Garden would be fine. What do you mean? I'm sorry, I I'm misunderstanding. A little full list of chow that are available until the closure that were available until the closure of the online services along with the company text that supported. Okay. Modern versions. In all other versions of the game, Black Market became an independent room without the need of the internet. Chow items and other products are made available in exchange for rings. Black Market will display items at random, but will increase the variety of items as you collect more emblems. Okay. So I might need to play the game a little bit more. You may notice that certain eggs never appear no matter how much you wait or how many emblems you collect. This is because when your Chow save game is created, there'll be three colors plus the shiny version that will never appear. Oh, I didn't know this. Making a game solely about Chow would be fine. It would remind me of Nintendox. Yeah, exactly! 
And each Sonic game, you could just add another Chow Garden with different things and just have, like, it connect to the mobile app sort of thing, kind of like what Pokemon Home does. It's a genius idea. So apparently, when you boot up... I didn't know this. Apparently, when I booted up this... This Chow Garden save, because it's a separate save. There's a set of three Chow eggs that are... Wait, never that will never appear. So obviously we have the white, yellow, and pink variety. There's the red, sky blue, and brown. And then there's the, br the blue, orange, and green. One of those sets is apparently not available to me. And I guess that's what encouraging uh, other memory cards, other friends, other friends that own the game, they might have a different set. And will never sell the one that's left out is randomly selected for every chow file. If one of these sets is seen in the black market, the next set of colors will only start appealing, appearing if you have obtained um, at least 100 emblems. Okay, that's how we change it. Okay. Interesting. There's a lot I don't know about Chow. The, the, the system is so deep. Honestly, I'm more excited to raising Chow sometimes. Um, okay, chat. I need a decision. If we are going to build a Chow in Sonic Adventure 1, which one do we use? We got the normal. We got gold and silver. We have white, yellow, pink. Or we can hold off until I get 100 emblems. And see what the other colors are going to be. Because we may have access to green, but we may not actually have access to green. I don't know. You... You think we should try to go for green? So far, that is the... That's the only answer I'm getting. I'll probably ask again later. But since that is the only uh, response I'm getting at the moment, maybe we'll save Chow Garden for later. Because apparently I need a hundred emblems for the next set of eggs to spawn. To even be an option. I didn't even know that was a factor. How many emblems are in Sonic Adventure 1? I'm gonna double check this. I forget if it's 120 or if it's 140. How many emblems? Emblems. Let me double check. There's 130 emblems. There's 130 emblems in Sonic Adventure 1. Some of them we have to get through Chow Garden anyway. But most of, most of them, if we are going to be trying to get the green one specifically, and even then we may not even get the green one. In trial mode... Well, we can get Sonic's other emblems. Two more per stage, except for Emerald Coast. We gotta do the A mission. Tails has five stages. Knuckles has five. Amy has three. Gamma has five. Big has four. Oh, I thought... I thought, like, Tails or Knuckles had six. Never mind. Mini games? I guess we could do a few of those. Adventure Field, we can't get all of them yet anyway. There's only five from the Chow race. And we get emblems for beating each of the campaigns. Okay. 
So if we're fine with the some slowdown that happens during this, we'll continue using Dolphin. Select your character. If we are trying to get a green chow, then we have to wait to get 100 emblems, which means we're going to be a while before uh, even... Uh... Yeah, I'm just going to let it hang on this menu. Uh, it's going to be a while before we even start doing the chow stuff then. And even then, we may not have access to green. But again, I, uh, w one other question I want to ask before calling it for today. Do we want to build one Chow in Sonic Adventure 2? Build it up there, because it'll be a little bit better there, and we have more options. And then bring it back here. Assuming I'm able to do that in Dolphin, which I think I can. And if I have to, I can boot up a Sonic Advance save if I want to make sure it's completely safe, which I can do that. I have Sonic Advance, and that has Tiny Chow Garden. Well, I think... I think I'll call it here. You know what I will do. Here's a link to the Discord. Because I'll probably discuss it more in there. But it sounds like we're not going to do Chow stuff for now. Oh, here we go. Oh, Popcorn Dog stuff. Uh, Todd stuff. Okay. I just met up since the world ended and consists of an old man who suffers from memory loss episodes. Can Sonic suffer from vinicular manslaughter? Here's what happens. Uh, and who used to be a part of the government agency. A nerd who sounds a lot like Robin, a country girl, and former undead eater who hear voices. Mm. Yeah, nope. They stopped the car before actually hitting me. I'm walking here! If I try to do this, nothing happens. I'm gonna spin dash ya! That's the best you can do. Anyway, if we're going with it, I want to discuss more of the Chow stuff, either on Discord or next stream. Uh, but if we're going with a different Chow, then we're, next time we're just going to probably start Tails missions or, yeah, probably start playing as Tails or something. Actually, actually, we don't have to play Tails next time. Damn sick. Sonic wouldn't live long in the States, that is true. If he was actually in New York, he wouldn't last long. He's probably frail. Next stream. Select Who do we character. play as? We don't have to go in order. Do we play as Tails, Knuckles, Amy, Big the Cat, or Gamma? Who do we play? Maybe I... Oh, I could give it... Get like a uh, roulette reel. Or leave it up to chat. I don't know. So far, I, I'm only getting one person responding. So it's basically up to you, Popcorn Dog. Who do we play as next time? Whoever you choose, we shall start this next stream with this character. One of five options. Do I have a fun? Do I have a five-sided die? I don't think that's a thing. No, there's a four one. Amy, she hit. She has a hammer, which means she's a strength build user. Okay. Next time, we shall start the stream with playing through Amy's three stages. She only has three. But yeah, we'll start with Amy Rose next time. Anyway, thanks for everyone who showed up. I'm doing these streams. Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. Kingdom Hearts 2 is on Wednesdays. Right now, Sonic Adventure 1 and I guess maybe 2 are back to back every other day. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at ScottBot64 Stream Archives. There's a link in the about page. Anyway, next time we start, uh, we start Amy's campaign. 
I'll, I'll probably discuss Chow stuff off stream. Three whole stages. <laughs> I mean, look, Sonic has ten stages, but at least Amy has a stage that Sonic can never enter. So, yeah, there you go. Anyway, I wouldn't mind discussing the Chow Garden stuff because I that is kind of really important. But anyway, have a good day. Later.